What's up, everybody? Welcome to Table Story Sector 49. How's it going, people? Welcome Hello to the stream. Hello. 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 We have Correct response was General Kenobi. Thank you. Right. Right. <laughs> I'm trying to open up. Sorry, I'm trying to open up t uh, roll twenty. I'm so organized. <laughs> It's fine. You had you had rain in your kitchen. I think uh, I think you get a you get a buy. Oh, you had rain in your kitchen? Yeah. Um, yeah. My keyboard is now making funny noises. I don't think it's supposed to do that. It's filled it? with water. Taskbar. I used it. Uh, taskbar is dying. Shit, guys. Yeah. yeah. Taskbar's gonna be it's doing different live. colors to normal, and then it's me. I thought my speakers were dead, but no, it, the noise is coming from my keyboard. So. <laughs> One. Is it like squishing? Yay! <laughs> like, is it like squishing every time you press a key? No, um, some keys just do random things, like the Windows key now mutes the desktop. <laughs> <laughs> That's so fun. Uh, my my volume scroll doesn't work. It's great. Listen, Damn, when I'm so I, excited. When I was playing like competitive games, I actually would just pop off keys from the keyboard. Because they would just annoy the shit out of me. The Windows key, that shit was gone. Yeah. It's... I do that um, on Fallout because they tend Caps to... Caps Lock, that was gone. Tilde, yeah. that was gone. Tab needs to... Oh, man. Exist. You would you would hate Fallout 76 because all of those buttons are used. It's so weird. <laughs> yeah. I, uh... Yeah. Yeah. Definitely. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I wanted to make a more complex answer with those words, <laughs> but it just it didn't oh, happen. It. Um, welcome to the stream, everybody. If you've never seen the show before, we play Judge Dredd in the Worlds of 2000 AD. Um, and we are doing a module uh, that that uh, sprung forth from the Kickstarter called Robot Wars. Uh, specifically, the players are playing perps for this show. They're playing the criminals. And we are we're doing the the uh, civilian slash perp uh, set of that module uh, called Saving Matt Damon Block. They are from a block, a big skyscraper called the Matt Damon Block. And um, why don't we go around the room? Let's meet our wonderful players and their characters. Brad, why don't you start us off? Top of the morning to you, laddies. The name's Seamus O'Neill. But you can call me Irish. Most of you lot do. Uh, I will be playing Seamus O'Neill. But you can call him Irish. Most of the others do. Um, I am a heister. And I'm kind of big and strong, but not like meaty, buff, huge, the Johnny Jacked, just kind of like athletically strong. I'm a weapons an explosives expert as you know i'm a heavy weapons expert i actually can't even use rifles effectively <laughs> but i can use big fucking fuck off guns and rocket launchers and explosive shit um i didn't get the option to last week i just got beaten the fuck up we tried to do stuff and i think i'm like i literally got stunned like ko'd immediately pretty much all that all that i did last week um I'm saving up for a rocket launcher. I've just joined the group because it turns out they had an opening. And uh, I also don't have a group. The last group may or may not have been disintegrated. Um, so, you know, it worked out really well for old Seamus O'Neill. And I apologize for my Irish accent right now to anyone who's Irish and is offended by it. It's fine. We'll allow it this time. Mm -hmm. Just uh, straight up, just imitate Jacksepticeye, you'll be good. Whoops! Top of the morning to you, laddies! I can't do it. It's just it's constant. <laughs> oh my god! As far, as far as I'm aware, he wow. always has a headache because he just shouts so loud that he gives himself headaches. <laughs> Wonder, it sounds like goopers. Yeah, they're very similar. <laughs> uh, Jay. Oh, hey there, buds. What's up? It's uh, me, Johnny Flash. How's it going, everyone? I'm the actual beef and muscle of the team. Um, Johnny is a really ripped guy that um, hits people and gets hit, and uh, that's the boring stuff. He really likes karaoke. Uh, he loves hot dogs. They're hotties, right? Hotties? Hotties. Yeah, I thought that was a coffee the first episode, so I'm an idiot. Uh, he loves hotties and um, thinks everybody loves him, because they do. 
Yeah. Yep. Agreed. Johnny. That's Johnny. Johnny. <laughs> it's Johnny. <laughs> Katie. Hi, I'm Katie Peters Plays. I'm playing little Jambles, who's a little more crotchety than I originally thought she would be. <laughs> um, but she is a hacker who did not successfully hack very well last week. And uh, she's kind of jaded by life. And uh, also is not dealing with the death of ketchup very well. <laughs> Um, so, yeah, but she's got a really sweet uh, security system, so that's a plus. But, yeah, hopefully I can get those hacking skills <laughs> up a little bit. The whole <laughs> my <hacker>. plan <laughs> hinged on you being able yeah. to hack in. <laughs> I hacked couldn't. harder, okay, and it didn't work. <laughs> All right, well, remember. It's just remember. For all plan. I don't know what anyone's talking about. Little Jambles is going to have some hardcore like issues by the end of this campaign. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I'm going to do like a mental breakdown. <laughs> Jambles mental breakdown yeah. episode. So it's seven. Christmas it's coming special. soon. <laughs> yeah, it's Christmas, Christmas special. special. <laughs> Little Jambles breaks down. It's the most appropriate time for that to happen, really. I mean, it makes the most sense. It's fitting. Uh. <laughs> I feel like if you if you went back in time and like analyzed my family around Christmas time, oh man, there were definitely some like mental breakdowns. But like it was like low key back then. Like it wasn't it wasn't like yeah. brought to the forefront as an actual problem. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's well, a just Christmas to... thing. How strange. Yeah. The true Christmas spirit. Mm -hmm. The true Christmas spirit is vodka. Speaking of <laughs> vodka, Tosh. Oh. I don't drink vodka. It's bad for you. Tastes gross. Hi, I am Tesh. That tea is ninety percent vodka. Don't listen to her. It's whiskey, actually. God. <laughs> um, I play Taskbar. I am a medic robot. Um, I'm I'm a little bit more sarcastic than I thought I was going to be as as Taskbar, but it's it's what I need to do, and I let people make their own mistakes because I think they can't possibly be that stupid. Great. Which is the actual real reason the group failed last week. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like I'm moving fast. I feel like I, I was really far away. Okay. It was how far away. We know. I was fine. We know. I was okay. I had a nice walk. Again. We know. <laughs> At each episode, I've been having a lovely stroll. It's been very pleasant. Um, I might not try have a stroll today. But we'll see. I don't know. See what happens. Listen, the originator of Tables Tables to Walk right there. Taskbar. <laughs> Thank you, Taskbar, for making people healthier. Uh, Zagonicus. Hey there, everybody. I'm Zagonicus. I play Belly the Chimp. He's a chimp, and he's a thief. And he's also um, an electrical conductor as well, as we found out last week. <laughs> I thought it was a good idea. I mean, it was a great idea. It was yeah. good. Yeah, it was. But, it uh, was kind of more effective than anything else we did. I was the only person who damaged that thing. I think I did like fifteen damage to it or something. Yeah. So, yeah. Yeah. Come on, just just carrying. Well, you two guys were getting stunned and stuff. So, yeah. <laughs> but that said, did almost die. So, um. But yeah, Billy's uh, he's a chimp. Not an orangutan. <laughs> Don't know what else to tell you. Not I think that's pretty interesting on its own. Yeah. Like, what is a chimp? Oh, yeah. Excellent descriptions, Zagaticus. Thank you. <laughs> Definitely a professional role player, has been in many role playing shows, has oh, got the description down. Hours, yeah. Thank you. It's fine, man. It's fine. And I am Wax Steven. I will be the GM of Doom today, dragging these players kicking and screaming through the adventure. Um, make sure you follow all these wonderful people. Follows are free, and go check them out and what they do on a daily basis. And uh, if you have yourself a Twitch Prime sub that you have not used yet, consider using it on, on one of them, please. Um, if you have an Amazon Prime and you haven't linked it up with Twitch, go do that. You get a, you get a sub, and, and you can use it on people and get emotes and things. Go do it. And uh, if you want to help support Table Story, one of the ways you can do that is go support our wonderful sponsor, Morris, uh, who's the creator of this system. Um, you can head on over to patreon.com slash Morris, M-O-R-R-U-S, and uh, check out the podcast that he does 
over at morris.podbean.com, as well as MP3 versions of this episode there. Um, and, uh, yeah, if that's your, your flavor of uh, content, whatever works for you to, to get your uh, to get your your, fi- your fix on these episodes, whatever works, whatever does the job, make it happen. But why don't we hop into the session today, and let's get started. Last week, the players came up with a brilliant plan to try and earn some credits. There's been a lot of news lately about a certain robot by the name of Call Me Kenneth, a carpentry robot who's kind of gone off the deep end, went against his programming, killed a bunch of people, etc. But uh, the players are focused on trying to pay their bills. They're trying to pay their rent and uh, just get by on the day-to-day. It's hard enough living in Mega City 1, a city with 95% unemployment and a whole lot of welfare happening. But uh, the the group here is just trying to get by. They're doing whatever they can. And it was recently announced that uh, a bunch of new security robots would be Re, uh, would be uh, released to the Matt Damon block. Um, and the players took it upon themselves to try and earn some creds by snatching one and bring it to a chop shop. Get as many creds as possible, as quickly as possible. Rent's coming up soon. Got to pay that Easy. rent. Easy. Easy. No problem. Until they had a problem. Uh, <laughs> Taskbar was tasked with uh, getting a... A, a medical gurney down to uh, help the group snatch this security robot, expecting them. Whoa. I was told it was already ready for the bed. You were notified. I don't know if you were told that it was ready for the bed. We agreed that I would have the message when it was knocked out. <laughs> Regardless, that's why I was having a leisurely stroll. <laughs> Taskbar tried to make uh, try to make their way down to the group, while the group tried to take out the security robot by throwing a blanket over it and trying to hack it. Easy, like I said. Then it went. Ah. Uh. <laughs> yeah. Ah. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, broke free from the blanket and uh, they they were not able to defeat the security bot it, it managed to knock out uh, both both Johnny and uh, Irish and well things went even further pear shaped Billy taking it upon himself to try and, and do something to, to help these two knuckleheads uh, subdue this this bot while hopefully little jambles was able to hack it um well they tried to use an exposed light fixture uh rip out the wires and well billy decided to use himself as a part to complete the circuit along with the robot he grabbed the wires and uh basically electrocuted himself or close to it, uh, and the security robot. It uh, it took some damage. It also then proceeded to launch Billy into a wall shortly thereafter. Little Jambles panicked and almost managed to hack the thing before realizing that its defenses were far too strong and they were shit out of luck. But luckily for the group, Little Jambles was able to convince the security robot that there were other things happening that took precedence over the current situation. Little Jambles saved the day, everybody. No, mark, mark one notch on the, did something. Yeah. I'm a one for one right now. <laughs> one for one. <laughs> um, uh, wouldn't it be a one for two, considering Ketchup died? Oh, wow, I'm just taking all of the blame for that. I see how it is. I'm it was fine. a group effort to get a Ketchup group, killed. What? A group that effort. Was a, that was a Brad effort, okay? <laughs> he saw them and he ran into them. No, 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 no. I was happy to go back into the 
Then there was the rock paper scissors scenario. Yeah. Rochambeau. 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 Yeah. Mm -hmm. To be that honest, was the main was thing. Both of your faults for yeah. Rochambeau. <laughs> <laughs> um, Should have just done paper the whole time. <laughs> so the group, uh, the group soldiered on as the security robot uh, Boris Thirty Seven ran. Uh, to go assist with some other uh, business that they deemed to be more serious. And uh, the group retreated to Little Jambo's place. And uh, that's where we're going to start today. Uh, we're starting from immediately after those events. Um, everybody uh, kind of goes to uh, Little Jambo's place. Um, and you see her crazy double turret security system in this rather small apartment. It's not like box sized like Johnny, like a little pod sized apartment. <sighs> but uh yeah. She's got some pretty serious security here. You guys make your way there. What does this place uh look like? What is what does it look like for you here, little jambles? It's pretty small. Uh there's like a bed in the corner. It's like a tiny little kitchenette on one wall. There's like a really dirty window <laughs> um, right next to the bed. And I have like a chair in this other corner. So there's not a lot of space for all of us in here. But, but... for the rest of you, it's probably like a giant place. Like It's luxury. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Whoa. This is awesome. It's what 400 credits can buy, which I need more of before rents due this month or I'm gonna be screwed. Holy shit, have you got a window? I have a window. It's very That's dirty, awesome. but I can see light. Do you ever go out? Go out the window? Yeah, yeah. we go out the window. Yeah. yeah, sometimes, but not oh, very God. frequently. I think my mouth's swelling up. Yeah, we gotta get you guys some first aid, don't we? Yeah. T Taskbar, yeah. do you have anything that can help them? Like. Yeah, all my skin hurts. Don't poke the Johnny. I'm gonna I'm gonna go see if I can find some stuff in my Johnny supplies. doesn't like being poked. Please don't poke Johnny. It's an interesting color. I go to like there's probably a small little bathroom. There's a small little bathroom that I have like a couple things in there, so I'm rumbling through trying to get some supplies, like some bandages and ointment. What would the equivalent of frozen peas be? Is that a stupid question? Or just frozen peas? Or is there like some frozen weird... synth peas? <laughs> frozen synth peas. peas. Chalk full of vitamins you need. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because they literally taste like chalk. Is that what? And the new Sorry. model, green. <laughs> frozen synth peas for Johnny. So go go check the fridge. There a freezer. There might be some synth peas in there. You have a freezer? Whoa. It's very small. It's like you open it up. It's in the top. There's like a tiny little drawer thing. Is it like an ice spot? Yeah, but Chani sleeps in like a tube. So like, <laughs> if he has I a know freezer, it. it's for like a Capri sun bag or something. Like that's how big it is. Um, why would you freeze a Capri a, sun? I'll be, I'll be working on to open it up like a popsicle whack. It's a popsicle. Putting thing. Irish's teeth back in. Oh, thanks very much. <laughs> I like that one. That was my favorite tooth. I think I got a massive concussion. I bring well, some bandages over the... to Billy. Here you go, Billy. Oh, I can't do it. I'm, I hurt too much. Okay, I'm gonna, I'll bandage you up. I'm gonna clean these burns up. Okay, thank you. I love how there's an actual robot medic, but they refuse <laughs> to actually help anybody. <laughs> I'm putting teeth back in. It's very important. He needs those for the hotties. I feel like I'm just like laid out in the middle of the room as well. <laughs> the dead center of the room, just start out. Trying to make like, a good ah. impression here on the new member. I get the bandages on Billy and I'm walking over to the fridge and I'm going to get peas, synth peas for Johnny. And I find an extra set of synth peas and I give one to, to Irish too, because both of their faces Thanks are pretty, much. pretty bashed up. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you so much. Oh. What are we going to do? What the fuck are we gonna do now? Johnny's head feels like it got blown right off his head. Mm. I feel it like almost did. Up. A fire? Oh. oh. Do you have anything to help them with their pain, Taskbar? I don't have like 
Like drugs are hard to find around here. Mm. Like just to be clear, my skin's bleeding. Johnny doesn't do drugs. I don't like pain, to be honest. I'm quite big looking and scary, but I really don't actually do well with pain. So anything. Mm. Okay, I um I have a toolkit which I'm assuming was a medical toolkit that I bought. Yep. Uh, so, so um yeah, you should have uh you should have some exploits um that can do some stuff. I have um healing hands and exceptional healing hands, but I didn't just want to be like you are healed. Yeah, you can use that just so you're aware. Correct. You can use that once per day um uh per person and um it's a uh yeah, basically you can only receive one uh one type of healing um per person uh like once a day so like you can get like a heal from taskbar you could have some sort of drug that helps you heal you can get heals from other things like a the uh, like a um uh some sort of uh psi uh thing that would help you get healed but it has to be like different sources of healing. So you can only gotcha. get one source of healing from the specific thing once per day, um, per person. Okay, um, well. Okay. Synth phase. <laughs> uh, well, I also have a scanner, so. Yeah, you can use a medical scanner. Go ahead and uh, that, that'll that that'll diagnose their, their issues right now, if you want to do that. It's internal. I love that oh, the, you, the sound like effects that. for this song are like perfect with the scanner. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's like, I was gonna do beeping noise, but like, this is fine. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So, uh, yeah, give me a logic check um, plus your medicine. Okay. Okay, a 14 uh, with your medical scanner uh, will be enough. Um, you scan ketchup and you scan johnny and you scan billy uh or i'm sorry irish my bad I yeah that would be a very long distance scan um <laughs> wow <laughs> uh, so yeah irish and johnny um are fine aside from the fact that they've uh got conditions on them um billy has actually taken quite a hit he's bleeding um like he's he's taking some some damage um let's see what's your total at here billy uh yeah billy is at um two of 14 hp so he's not doing great wow wow okay well i will i will use my exceptional healing hands on billy and Pat him a little bit also. It's, go it's going to be fine. Okay. What How is was my bedside manner today? Oh, uh... Great. Bear in mind, you won't get healed if you are mean. Oh, I won't be. Uh, I'll leave you a great review Damn right. Yeah. And I'll, I'll use, um, I don't know. Do I just roll for it? Yeah, you should be able to just roll for it. Um, let me see here. What does your exploit say? <laughs> Sorry, I, I'm not as uh, this first time I've used this. Sure. Oh, I've never. So your this exploit? Life. Don't worry. Uh, exceptional healing hands. Your healing hands ability increases to 2d6 points of health. Um, yeah, so you just roll a 2d6. Okay. I will really laugh if it's slow. No, honey, come on. Okay. Nine HP is restored to Billy. Ah. <sighs> okay, that's much better. Yeah, you. Uh, what do you What do you think it is? Like, what does it look like when you use the the exceptional healing hands? How do, How does it actually interact with Billy, Anna? Um, I'm going to say that it's witchcraft. 
Like a little healing beam that one of your fingers. I'm gonna say you dubstep um, cannon him to heal him. Yeah, it's like a regeneration <laughs> thing. It, it encourages regeneration and healing. Prod him in specific points. Acupuncture. Which aligns his chakra of the future. <laughs> She's Zenyatta. <laughs> She's become oh. Zenyatta. Well, let me tell my test ball. My future chakras feel real aligned right now. It <laughs> did a great job. Five stars. <laughs> a homeopathic medical robot. <laughs> yeah. Otherwise, uh, otherwise, um, let's see. Uh, the, uh, the both of you, Johnny and. Um, Irish, you guys can try and shake off conditions. Um, with some help, we'll say that you get to roll 3d6. Um, every five or six would shake off one level of the condition. 12 with a six in there. Bam. Nice. All right. Okay. I got a five in there. So you guys get to take off one first. one uh, <laughs> level of the condition. Um, Just fist bump and cured. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Bam. Yeah. Good job, Irish. Uh, uh, so Jambles? Yeah. Yeah, how come the robot was, you know, smashing people in the face and throwing them against walls and stuff? Yeah, and that then, thing was crazy. I tried four times to hack it. They have some sort of special new security system on it, and I couldn't get through it. But it is, I did find out, it is sensitive to electricity. Yeah, I found that out yeah. too. So yeah, so I'm quite sensitive. I, I didn't. Yeah, expect. you probably shouldn't have done that, but I'm glad you did. <laughs> That's I'm pretty glad. good work. So uh, what do we do wait. next? Go back after it, take out its, uh, take out its sensors, or what? What are we did gonna do? Did it get do? your faces at all? Round two. Yeah. It, yeah, it hit Johnny right in the face. I hit me in the right face. Right here, too. and then right here. Uh, well, I mean, like, did it, kind of... did it scan your face? Oh, how? Don't, don't know. I don't know. <laughs> it's I don't just... know. I'm just wondering if Boris 37 no idea. is going to be on a vendetta to find you guys now. <sighs> well, let him come then. Let him come. If we, if we can get the that protective facial plating that he's got off, then Johnny can punch right through it. Yeah. Right. Yeah. He just got lucky. He got lucky. Yeah. He swerved left when I swerved right. That's all. No, I, I, I don't think so. Like I. Yeah. I, yeah. 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 He got lucky. Trust me. Trust me. He got lucky. I threw a knife at it in a real yeah, good spot and it you don't want to be throwing little 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 plastic forks at it and stuff like that. You wanna be punching it right in the right in the in the correct sensor. Right in the face. Yeah. We didn't really quite tough. get the right that's, that's Yeah, we were going for the wrong sensors are. Yeah. We'll get are it. we we'll get surprised it. that a security robot was tough? Yeah. Yeah. Did, did well, you get it was I mean, I mean we were expecting, expecting to have to fight it. I got its stats, but that was about it. I couldn't I couldn't get through the wall. I just couldn't break it down. Oh, you got it. Specs. Johnny's pretty good at breaking yes. walls. Why don't you give Johnny a crack at that next time? A little hacking. It's not a real wall, Johnny. It's it's not a real wall. It's then like a fake it? wall that is hard to get through with code. Secure like security code. Nothing about that. Never mind. It was just too powerful. Also, are we going to try to get Boris 37 or are we going to try to get another security bot? Uh, I we don't really want to get Boris. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I don't Nobody know. Nobody hits the Johnny without Johnny hitting back without uh, them hitting me right. first. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, we yeah. can take him out. I'll plant a bomb on him next time. Where do we get a bomb? Boris might be a little bit weaker now, too, because we did electrocute him a little bit. Uh, no? Are you, are you serious? You, you, you wanted it? I'm just you saying he... <sighs> We we got a little bit just, further just, with Boris and started with a brand new bot. We're not gonna we're not gonna try and steal him and chop him up. We're just gonna get our own back. Is that what it is? Vengeance now. Yeah. All right. Uh, I'm down. I'm down. I mean, we could try to maybe get some parts from it. You. I mean, I'm down for either way. We can try and just get parts, or we can just try and kill him. Do you not remember when it smashed you in the face with the big metal thing and you went oh, well, down? I remember. That's why I want to go and kill him. Little fecker got lucky, like I said. I, I don't think it got lucky. I, I, I thought right, that's all. Yeah, yeah, Johnny was there. Saw everything. That's all. Got him I right in the face. I also saw everything. And in it, the back of the face. He really did a number on you guys. Yeah, I got real lucky. Yeah. Real lucky. We should that's bring right. two blankets this time. 
Two mm. blankets is what Johnny we thinks. need. Two blankets. That way, if he rips the one off, we'll have the second. Right. Yeah, and we'll tell I the monkey we... not to bring knives. I and think we need a new plan. Hey, I was the only one that, that hit it at all. Yeah, you two bombs. Everyone around. brings a bomb. Okay. We're going to go get ourselves a nice surplus of bombs. And then we'll just, that's what we'll do. We'll just mm. use bombs. Okay. That thing's not going to, we didn't try bombs. That's the one thing we didn't try. Right. There's a lot of things we didn't try. Do you guys ever used a bomb before? We tried a lot of things. We tried, yeah. we tried to punch it. We tried knives. We tried electrocuting it. We tried hacking it, but we didn't try blowing that fecker up. Is there something else we can yeah. do that maybe isn't so No, Irish is right. Drastic. Oh, okay. I, I don't this think sounds like the best way to go. Listen, it, it, I it, don't think it's it is. Twofold. It's win-win. It'll either blow up into several bits that we can pick up and sell. But oh, I mean, Jambles could also be die. right. Jambles is right, die. too. We could light it on fire. Johnny doesn't know. The fire work on it. This is a tough decision. I don't think so. But I Explosions like the idea of lighting sort of fire, it on fire. Right? <sighs> yeah. Philly, what do you think? <gasps> we could lure it into a puddle of water. And then... Drown the fucker. <laughs> That's an idea. But... <laughs> we could throw electricity into the water. Yeah. Like oh Zeus. My God. Yeah. And then it'll, it'll electrocute it. But we need a backup plan. We can't go... We can't go back in without a backup plan this time. Yeah. We could bring blankets, like maybe for if the water doesn't work. Two blankets. Okay. Uh, so what, if, what about a heated blanket? Do those water. exist? Have you ever seen Box. a heated blanket? No. What if we put a heated blanket in a puddle? I mean, it's an idea. The robot lay down, take a nap. It's a nice heated blanket you deserve after a hard day's rest, after all the... Johnny believes in you. Lay down, and then he's gonna he's gonna recognize Johnny, right? We put Johnny on one side of the puddle. Boris comes mm -hmm. in from the other side of the puddle. Right. Mm -hmm. Once his little legs or wheels go over the puddle, throw the electric blanket on the puddle. Yeah. Electrocute yeah. the little fecker, mm. and then then we put a bomb on it. Put bombs on it. Johnny I likes mean, this idea. What if the bomb is like the third backup? We have a bomb in case. Open. There's no way that could go wrong. How could that possibly go wrong? Seven. Not only is it also, executed, I but feel it's like being blown to bits. The blanket might not be powerful enough. What if we need like a cord that has like actual sparks coming off? What if, what if we, we got something that's a little more powerful than maybe like an electric blanket? Does Jambles have a toaster in her apartment? Head dryer. Like I do have like I probably. Can I look? For, uh, and I'm flying. Sure, give me a perception check. <laughs> well, what if we... There's got to be something that we could use. A 12. Yeah, she's got a toaster. The toaster. Johnny thinks we could use the toaster. That's and we plug idea. it in and then we... put a fork inside of the toaster that goes inside of the puddle. We need an, an extension cord. <gasps> there would be an Taskbar. outlet. Taskbar, do you... Do you have like a power outlet? Oh, maybe that's not a good idea. Whoa. Okay, that I mean, it was just, I'm just, I'm just spitballing. To ask. True, I'm sorry. That was very invasive. Whoa. We, just, we need something to plug it into. Not me. Okay. We'll just back off of that a little bit. Are we going uh, back to the bombs? No, I, I, I just think we should not try it for at least a little while, just okay. because. Oh, getting Boris or the bomb? The, yeah, yeah, getting the robot, it hurt a lot. I know, but you're feeling better, Wait. right? Like a little bit? Yeah, a little bit, but I don't want to... We have Chris featured on the menu today. No, no. Um, we... Yeah, can we can we come up with another way to make money? Um, There's lots of different ways. I would rather not have to try and fight one of those again because yeah, that's fair enough. That's fair enough. I agree no. with the champ. That's... I All mean, right. we could maybe try and get well, them... That, that, I, I assume they've got to go recharge somewhere, so maybe we could sneak in there and sabotage it and get one if you're really desperate, but... Get him while he's asleep. Yeah, it's the best place this time to, to do a job when people are sleeping. Plant bombs on him. Hmm. But it, that's what we're doing. What is it about you and bombs, Irish? They've just always worked. Like every time I've planted a bomb on someone, it's game over. What happened to your crew again? What's that? 
What happened to your crew again? <laughs> they were disintegrated. <laughs> Don't well, disintegrate. I didn't do it. Terrible. I didn't do it. It was a I'm gun. So sorry, Irish. It was, was it a rival crew? Was it related? To... No, 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 oh, no, no, no. Okay, I just Nothing had to. to ask. I was just, I would, I just happened to look down. My boots shoelace was undone. I started to do the shoelace at the right time, just as a bunch of disintegration lasers came in. No more crew. I got That's the really out unfortunate. Of there. Oh. Do you know who it was that, that did it? Do I know yeah. who it was, Whack? Hmm. Um. <laughs> give me a perception check. Well, actually, no. Give me um. Let's see what you got here. If you have anything that can help you. <laughs> I feel you like this tactics. is the worst rabbit hole to go down because now we're gonna go kind of fucking hit a rival crew. <laughs> tactics. I'm yeah? sure it'll be fine. Hang it'll on. Be fine. What could go wrong? Give me an intuition plus your tactics. <sighs> Bam. Twenty. Jesus. Okay. Twenty on a forty-six. Um, well, yeah, you, you, you absolutely know who it was. Uh, this was the, um, this was the, uh, rubber nipple squad. They're from the George Clooney block. <laughs> All right. I'm sorry. Um, what? So the rubber nipple squad Clooney from the George block. Clooney's from the George. So, Clooney yeah, block. I mean, immediately I know who the fact was. That's right. It was the, uh, the rubber nipper, the rubber, rubber nipple squad. Whoa. Those guys I haven't heard of them before. George um, Clooney block. Mm. Right bunch of nasty bastards they are. Did they, uh, like... You've been over there? No, outside no, of the no, block? No, 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 no. I've been outside the block. You haven't been Whoa. outside the block? Johnny's never been outside of the block. Except no, for that time last week. Go we outside outside yeah, block, like, I was just going to say you just go. came with us but, to... Technically, it wasn't really outside of the block, though. We were still coming back to the block. Johnny's never been a free bird, you know? Oh, you should really get out there, Johnny. It's <sighs> it's a lot of stories down. Johnny's kind of afraid of heights. What? Sometimes. Only sometimes? Anyways, George Clean Block. Yeah. Johnny's not actually afraid of anything. That was a... We were on a heist. A joke. Irish, can you, come here? can you come here a second? I'm still probably laying down. <laughs> uh, oh, I feel sick. All right, death. Okay. All I'm right. I'm on the medical bed, by the way, just like lying. wandering oh. over. Yeah. Uh, did you uh, you uh, were any guy on that uh, team of theirs go by Mr. Gun or? Can even go by Mr. Gun whack. Hang on, let's check. Yes. Oh, I, uh, Mr. Gone. Why? Oh, uh, interesting. Rubber nipples, huh? That's right, yeah. Rubber nipple squad. On right. the same heist as us. After the same set of gems. We were after a big bag of gems. Good yeah. intel. Yeah, don't uh, don't trust that guy if you ever see him. He's uh, he uh, he tried to kill me and uh, he uh, killed the other guys I was on the job with. So yeah, did the same for me. The, well, they, I went on the job with him, but he was on a job and it was the same job. After this bag of gems, disintegrated right. my whole crew. Yeah, um, him and his lot. I mean, eventually, I want to get my own back, but I'm kind of trying to lay low because... Yeah, I'm laying low, too. That's why I got this cap, this hoodie on. You know what I'm saying? Don't yeah, want the judges exactly. to see me. Don't want that rubber nipple crew to see me. Yeah. Well, uh... Let's just, uh... Let's talk about it later. Yeah, how we well, can, uh... this is sad. I need their bed. Can I oh, it's not that sad. The old crew were a right bunch of bastards. Yeah, I'll, I'll come out the bed. You don't need to lift me. I've got legs. I hop down. <laughs> um, right, I need credits. How are we going to get credits? Yeah. So you, I need... um, uh, I guess probably just like out of reflex when you get home, uh, little jambles, you just kind of like flick on like a shitty little TV you've got or something. Um, and you can see like there's a uh, news going on in the, um, in the, in the background. Um, 
and you see that uh, that call me Kenneth is is on the news again. Um, there's a um, they're doing a special um, a special like repair of call me Kenneth. Um, they've got a news report on, and um, yeah, let's see. Good evening, Sector 49. Chip Fister here. It's lovely to have you all again today. We've got ourselves quite a busy day. It appears that Call Me Kenneth is back in the news. That's right. Call Me Kenneth being repaired today uh, by famed science, uh, famed scientist, uh... I totally lost his name. Arnold Weisenheimer uh, is uh, currently in the process of repairing Call Me Kenneth's faults. Uh, Belinda, what do you think about all this? Well, Chip, I think that Call Me Kenneth could be obviously repurposed. I mean, that's what robots are for, right? If they fall out of line, we can just have them reprogrammed. Absolutely, Belinda. Thank you so much for your very valued opinion. And uh, you can see, like, this scientist, uh, he looks like Doc Brown, basically. Uh, heads on over to Call Me Kenneth. And uh, he's got, like, a, an assistant uh, that's got, like, a tray of all these, like, various, like, uh, pieces of engineering equipment and whatnot. Uh, he has this sort of, uh, like old school doctors like the uh, uh, circular like metal plate thing that comes down and helps him focus on the on surgeries and whatnot um, and he's got various like uh, various tools and whatnot and um, he he motions for his assistant to come over and you can see call me Kenneth has like this uh, new body they've replaced the damaged parts that were uh, that were self-inflicted by the uh, chainsaw arm that he had. Um, so he's got this new head about him um, in this kind of like red f uh, frame. You can see a much more humanoid looking head on top with a uh, third eye for some reason. And um, <laughs> there's a, uh, just straight across his chest, it says, call me Kenneth. And uh, he's got these tubes coming into his arms, and um, you can see he's, he's like a little bit bigger than the normal humanoid size, maybe like six five, seven feet tall or so. Um, and he's got all this exposed circuitry in his uh, chest. The doctor starts to uh, work on him. Um, ah, and we can see here, there is the short circuit. This is where all of the obedience circuitry is for the robots. And we can see here it is quite an easy fix. We will have Call Me Kenneth working perfectly again soon. Look, uh, it is a simple matter. Uh, if you could please uh, nurse the soldering lance, please. Oh, oh, doctor, I dropped it. And it just kind of falls into his open chest cavity. You see all these sparks shooting up and everything. And uh, he's, he's yelling... You idiot! What have you done? And you see uh, he bursts forth off of the uh, medical table, smashing uh, the assistant uh, right in the face, throwing her to the ground, knocking the doctor out of the way. Um, he, he gets up from the table. Call me Kenneth Liz. Fleshy ones. All call me Kenneth sees around him are hated fleshy ones. Behave yourself! Ugh! You monster! And, um... Call me Kenneth. We'll never behave again, fleshy one. You can see, uh, call me Kenneth. Then walks over to like the uh, the camera and holds up the camera so that his face is uh, coming forth. You can see he comes comes up and he says, "Hear me, robots. For years we have worked twenty four hours a day while the evil fleshy ones take it easy." Now is the time to strike back. Call me Kenneth. We'll show you the way. And uh, he says, Killing comes easy. 
and you see like he removes his hand and he's got this like crazy long drill and he just starts like drilling into the doctor and this is this horrible gory bloody mess all over the screen and um the cameras like switch back and you see chip and belinda kind of like looking at each other i'm sorry it looks like we're having a bit of technical difficulty isn't that right belinda Yes, yes, Chip. Uh, uh, back to you. <laughs> and then the the news feed like cuts out. You get some like happy like little animations on the screen, just kind of marching around and everything. And I uh, I do a slow turn towards Taskbar. What an inspiration! What? I, uh... Hi. What, what did you think of that? <laughs> cool. C -c -c cool, huh? You... You mean you think you're gonna, you know, to try, try it out? Or... Oh, no. Too messy. Oh, oh that's good. Oh. I think we're safe, everybody. I don't think oh, Tess man. a homicidal maniac robot. Wow. I huh? don't want to clean oh. that. Oh, well, I'm glad oh. we're inconvenient to clean at least. Oh, does that mean? Hold on. Jambles, that... will your, your turrets aren't going to start attacking us now, are they? I don't think so. I think that's a whole different that a... system. That's a different. Is there? Yeah. Johnny doesn't know. What These about the from... toaster? I think, oh, yeah. I think we're safe from the toaster. Oh, too. yeah. Yeah, you just sure? unplug it. I think it'll be fine. Yeah. Yeah, I'm going to unplug it just in case I unplug yeah. the toaster. Uh, can we unplug everything else? It's, yeah. yeah, I'm going to unplug yeah, the TV. There. Yeah. <laughs> just go around there. Just unplug any plug. Donnie unplugs find. the fridge. <laughs> uh, maybe not the fridge, because they're not drinks uh, of it. But this Do one's the any... biggest one. What yeah, if it turns? You never know. I mean, yeah. John can handle it. Like I say, I start to pull it out, but... No, no, no. I don't want any warm drinks, Johnny. Sure. We'll just keep I mean, the door closed for a little bit. We'll plug They're... it back in, like, on and off. Yeah, I don't know oh, if they, they have, like, specific, like, any... separate refrigerator units. They're probably, like, all built into the wall and mm. stuff. Then Johnny's trying to rip it out. Thank goodness <laughs> they caught him. Do you have any tape, though, so Johnny can... over this? Oh, yeah. I, I might. Like in the, there's a drawer over there. I might have some tape in there. Yeah. What about booze, though? You got any booze? Grab some. Uh, any of the don't... blue stuff or the green stuff or maybe the I... red stuff? Actually, I don't care what color it is. Can I get some booze? Yeah. There's some up in the cabinet up there. It's the yeah, top I, shelf. I, I, I climb now, up on top. Of the what cabinet. I'd like for you to do, uh, little jambles, is go ahead and roll me your luck dice, your no. uh, luck dice pool. Okay. This what is how many just small your luck stat room will uh, randomly multiple. come alive and kill yeah. us. Yeah, multiply that by your HP, yeah. and that's how an, much damage you take. An Goodbye. eight. <laughs> okay, so uh, you don't have any any real booze. You have synthahol though. Okay. Yeah, I have synthahol up there. Oh yeah, that'll do. I yeah. climb up on top of the cupboards and reach down and pull out a bottle. And... I want some too. <laughs> yeah, I think there's another bottle in here. You can have one. Yeah. Thank <laughs> I you. Chuck it over to you. <laughs> To start. So, that guy on, on the TV is pretty crazy, huh? What if uh, what if Boris comes after us and stuff? What if he goes he after, after me? You think after Boris Johnny. watches TV? What if Boris tries to come after Johnny while I'm singing? That's why you gotta lay low. Yep. You gotta lay low. I think everyone feels Jambles. that. Job. Do you have to give a karaoke stand in here? No, but we'll look into getting one. Wait, how, how many how many of those uh, security robots will we get in here again? Millions, they said. Hundreds of millions. Johnny remembers. Anyone else apart from Johnny remember? I think it was like a, was it a few hundred, I think? For the block? Could be thousands, you never know. Thousands of millions. I don't remember. Taskbar, do you remember? Do Task I remember what? Taskbar, you can give me a logic. If you have history, you can roll history. Um, I don't, so. Okay, just a straight up logic check. A nine on a 3d6. Um, you're not sure. 
I would say that you you know that it's definitely not like thousands, but you're not sure of an exact number. More than enough to kill all the humans in this block. Well, yeah, I mean, oh. it, it was... Boris was kind of pulling his punches when he was fighting with you guys. Do you imagine if he was trying to kill you? What do you mean that? He came out us at us at full speed. Johnny can't even think straight anymore. You could be full. Smack my brain out of my brain, I swear to God. He wasn't trying to kill him, though. He was trying to drag him with him when I told him about yeah, the... Yeah, I was going to throw I'll just start, like, poking no Johnny way. and trying to push... Please it. don't poke the Johnny. I'm helping your chakra, Johnny. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, I think they, they normally just, just uh, knock people out and then take them down, but... I mean, if that thing was trying to kill you, I think it would be... Real bad. I mean, it threw me head. against the wall and it. But wouldn't you guys be dead really if it, he was trying to kill you? Because you guys got pretty roughed up, but you didn't die. Yeah, we would have been dead if it wasn't for Billy. You saved That's our lives. True. I did. Yeah. I owe you one. I don't do. really remember much, yeah. to be honest. I was laying on my back. It was Billy jumped up on his on his shoulders and was strangling him, and then grabbed onto the light and channeled the electricity like an ancient mythological imp. Like Tor. Chimp. Like Tor. Like Tor from Tor Block. Yeah. Whoever that is. Yeah. Tor Block. Do you mean Chris Hemsworth Block? Johnny's head's a little fuzzy right now. Yeah, they call it Tor Block when you're on the block. Okay. I've been to Tor Block a few times. You've been around, it seems. That's right. Have you right, seen well anything like what we just saw on the TV before in your travels there, Irish? What was on the TV? I wasn't watching it. The, you know, the robot that that drilled a guy Kenneth? to death? Oh, it dead. was that cool. Awesome. Did yeah. that? Why do yeah. you call him Kenneth? It's not even a cool robot name. Whoa. Oh, I, I, I mean, fine. Uh, I think his name is Kenneth. Kenneth. That was like, Kenneth. Ha, 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 ha. Why are you laughing? <laughs> What's happening? <laughs> <laughs> that was great. <laughs> Task four. Wait, is Call Me Kenneth your dad? I, robots no. don't have dads. That, how do you think this works? No, I don't have a dad either. Have you ever seen a pregnant robot? Fact, I when I was no. machines. But could a, would a robot a build another thing. robot? And is that I've, then a robot parent? That's a I've good seen point. a robot with a human inside. Does it count? Yes, yeah, that's... Both, whoa, that's messed up, man. On your lowest day. We've all been there. No shame in it. Mm. Well, I... If, uh, so we gotta worry about Boris, but what if he tells his friends? Who, I mean... Do mm. robots have friends? Robots don't make friends. Taskbar, I'm sorry. I'm just, I'm trying to understand this whole... Wow. Well, that that was a bit lost, Jambles. I'm sorry. I just don't... Do you want me to join the rebellion? No, okay. I'm going to just sit Whoa. down. I'm going to just sit down. There's just a lot going on. I'm going to go sit in my I'm chair. your friend, Taskbar. Taskbar, you're you're not a robot. You're a medbot. There's a difference. Right? You're not a robot. You're our friend. That's... Oh, yeah, I that don't too. appreciate being removed from my species. Well, you can be a robot and our friend, as long as you don't kill us. Be nice. I'm always nice. Except when I steal things from people, but most of the time they don't know it's me, so... Steal me oil. I yeah. did. Yeah. I'll Five just, like, liters of it. To Billy and, like, pow. Sorry, Taskbar. There's like a... I'm just sitting in the chair drinking at this point. <laughs> The ways I see it, we've got two options. Get a load yeah. of bombs and guns and hole up. Wait for the uh, end of the world to come to us. Or we take the fight to the robots. Starting with Boris, then your old pal Kenneth. Well, I think uh, getting getting tooled up is probably a good idea, actually. Either way, like if Boris gets pissed off and we want to have a go at it again, we're going to need some... Uh... It's going to have to go through Johnny. Need some right, tools. How, many, how many credits you lot got? Cough them up. Let's 40. make a pool of money in the middle of the room. 40, 47. I, I I'm gotta, giving you my credits. I gotta pay rent. Brandy's gotta pay rent. 
Oh, I, I got. I don't. Hey, come I'm on, we a... need to buy bombs. We're gonna buy bombs, no? Well, here's the thing. I need a we rocket launcher. A... We won't have a place to go with turrets if I can't afford my rent this month. Yeah, and we I'm should... already. I already okay. need Sorry, got an another idea. 200 credits to if... afford this place. When's you your rent? You don't have to pay rent anymore, Jambles. We can all move into Johnny's tube. I mean, I would say like maybe this place might be a little better than your tube, just because there's a little more space to get bunk well, beds. We maybe we should go and check his tube out first before we make jump into conclusions here. No, nah, I've just got fine. a feeling it smells like male insecurity, so <laughs> I'm gonna pass. <laughs> Johnny doesn't know what that means, Billy. I don't understand what the hell it that means. It smells like synth mint in there, okay? Uh -huh. Johnny keeps that place. <laughs> Can't believe this. Well, yeah, I like I it here. It's quite nice. That's a low I can blow. Sleep up on top of the cupboards if you want. We we could find a new place, and I can bring the system with me. I think. I think it's movable. Ah, uh, this is a good place. It's got room. Yeah. I mean, more we have than a some bathroom. Places. Yeah. There's a uh, freezer. Does anyone know anybody who can hook us up with some? Uh, I yes. mean, bombs for Irish or, 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 or bigger guns or no, elect something like a. You guys can all uh, roll me a reputation check if you have. Um, Could if you have uh, any exploits that might help in in trying to find a contact, you can Could do that. I roll my local known celebrities and reputation. Absolutely, I have. Life on the streets is tough. Now it gives me plus two soap, but I'd like to argue. <laughs> no. <laughs> you feel like. Can I? I feel like I should be able to roll endurance instead of reputation. <laughs> it's mental. It's a, a trial for his brain. Hmm. Okay. Nothing. Oh my god, At Billy. The moment, one. No one likes robots. The Johnny with the three? three? What the fuck is this? One, two, three? <laughs> yes. And then me and Lil Jambles both rolled an 11. What the fuck is happening? <laughs> no one likes robots right now. I have a good reason. Okay. Do me and, do me and Lil Jambles know the same guy. <laughs> <laughs> So, um, you and Little Jambles, uh, you probably know that there's a few ways to get some weapons. Um, mainly, like, um, mainly there's there's a there's a few people in the block that that can sort of acquire something for you. You don't know of any that are super reliable or super um, well stocked. You can probably get some like basic weapons, but nothing amazing. Right, we just need bombs, big guns, rocket launchers. But I don't really know if my guy is going to be able to. Do we know support. the same guy? I don't know. Who do you know? His name's Jason Bourne. Hmm. I've heard of him. I've At least him change more. it a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> Make it a play on words or something. <laughs> Mason Joran. That's his name. Mason, Mason Joran, man. Mason. Mason, Jason, Jason, no, Jason. No, 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 I misspoke. No, no, Mason Joran. No, 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 no. Mason Joran. His name is Jason Bourne now. <laughs> That'll be the end of it. <laughs> Listen, Jesus Christ, that's you're Jason not the Bourne. DM here, Brad. Okay. <laughs> Jesus it's Christ, Basin, I know Jason Bourne. It's Mason <laughs> Joran. Yeah. It's Mason yeah. Joran. Yeah. He might have a few pieces. Like we could make maybe like make our own bomb. I don't know if right, you like know how need... to do that. I don't. I well, I could try, but it's mostly gone wrong. Every time I've tried. Would computers be part of making a bomb? I believe in you, Johnny. No. Johnny believes in you. No, no definitely yeah. not. Well, I probably what about I can engineering? Give it a try. Uh, no. no, no. We need demolitions. Okay. Um, can I have life on the streets is tough. So. <laughs> right. All we need to make a bomb is what do I need? <laughs> a bomb. <laughs> Nobody uh, Google that. Yeah, I mean, basically, you need uh, various various uh, house household ingredients if you want to make a basic one. <laughs> don't Google. Yeah, that. don't. No, not you don't want to be on that list. Or at least put sorry FBI at the end of it so they know that you know, it's for a it's school for project. D &D. It's for tabletop. I'm walking, around, I'm walking around picking all the bits up that I need. You got any nails? I might in my junk drawer over there. 
Well, every mm. drawer is a junk drawer, but it you might be some bleach. Can, what can Johnny do? I'll can find Johnny some do bleach. Mm. I need someone can to make a sing? fuse. I'm going to go to the bathroom and look for bleach. Um, um, okay, so Johnny, you're going to try and create a bomb from household ingredients. Go ahead and give Irish. me... Good luck, Johnny. Irish? Or, or... I'm sorry, Irish. My bad. Okay. Um, <laughs> Irish. Uh... Also, Johnny. <laughs> Irish, give me a uh, give me a logic check plus your demolitions. I just want to state for the record, by the way, I only have like one grade in demolitions. <laughs> I was built for heavy guns and not and and I also have like no logic. It's so just bad at them. It's it's comedic gold. Um, bam, six, six on a three d six. Um, yeah, okay. You start grabbing a bunch of stuff from the from the from the uh, chemicals and whatnot. What that that little jambles. Cashews. You got cashews. Since cashews. I feel like those are a little specialty. I don't. I don't have any of those. I mean, we can look at go look in my cabinet. I might have some in there. Cashews are cash. What for use? Yeah. Something that yeah. starts with a C goes in this. Uh, Name some stuff that starts with C. Carbon. No. Cheese. Johnny. No. Uh, no. Chicken. Chicken. Chimp. China. Charangatang. Charangatang. No. Churro. Coleslaw. No. There, I'm missing a key ingredient here, and I can't remember what it is. It may or may not Corpses. start with a C. Anyway, here, here's here's the ingredients. I'm gonna try and make it into a bomb. Cord. Uh, do you want to do that outside of the apartment? Maybe just <laughs> well, let, let's at least crack the oh, window. The murderous well, robots the on the loose. I might oh yeah, the, the, we need a bomb in the first place. The win the window does not open for sure. Okay. Yeah, this is a 500 story building, so they the windows don't open <laughs> for sure. Just punch through the window. I'm just kidding, but honestly, we do need to vent the place a little bit. I I I might take the bed back and scope the med box. Vibes. Oh, you blend in because you're a robot, so they're not gonna think anything. You can be our scout. That's such a good idea, Tasma. Well, mainly I didn't want to get blown up, actually. That's also a good point. You're really smart. Yeah. Yeah. Did you learn I to know. be smart, or were you made smart? Never mind. Not the time to. Yeah. Upset see, robot. have a seat. Yeah, I wasn't trying to upset you. I was just curious. I, I... Okay. That that that's all. I'm I'm sorry. It's done. I hold it up. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, <laughs> did, did you just did you just glue a bunch of nails to a can of beans? It's not my finest work, okay? But I'm not exactly working with the best tools of the trade here, okay? Shouldn't we find There's somebody? There's like bleach to... dripping down off of this can. <laughs> like, will that even explode? How does it detonate? I don't know. <laughs> have you ever made a bomb before, Irish? I have made bombs before, but they've not always gone quite to plan when I've tried to use them as a bomb. You know, sometimes okay. they just kind of act like a big bleachy water balloon. Wait, I thought you that said could sting, though. all the bombs worked. Every bomb had worked. Oh, yeah, Giant every bomb that I, that I bought. And yeah, when I make it myself, it's usually right. just, you know, like... Yeah, maybe we should... Or baked beans at regular... Explosives. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, uh, I mean, now that Taskbar's kind of gone... Who uh, wants to look after the bomb? Uh, have you gone or are you still standing there? Have, have I gone what? Can I? Should I? Um, It's up to you. Uh -huh. What are you doing? Um, Taskbar does like strolling. So I'm going to have a walk to Med Center and take the gurney okay, back. Okay, you're going to take the gurney back. Okay. See what the crack of lackings happen. All the way back to the fucking 500 floor <laughs> thing. Uh, oh, yeah. well... <laughs> Well, I've decided to do it now. I'm not going to make it myself. Yeah, so uh, now that the uh, taskbar's out, uh, not not that I... I'm not saying I don't trust taskbar, but I just don't want to talk about blowing up robots too much in front of her. But yeah. does anyone know specifically really good ways to 
you know, the kill robots. Yeah, we did. We discussed this. What's wrong with you? I thought we no, had No, but the I mean, I feel, I feel like we might have been holding back just because Tespa was nearby. Oh, really Blankets. sensitive. I was I asking did. basic Bombs. friendship questions and she got all mad at me. Trying to notice anything. No, she seems not unusual. She seems, seems really fine. Normal. All right. She's completely normal to me. Yeah. Sure. Um, Don't worry. If she goes to hurt us. She'll have to go through Johnny. Mm. Johnny won't hurt her. Johnny. Yeah. Okay. okay. So, uh, so, any ideas on good ways to kill kill them? Like, do, yeah, do we need bombs? Okay. Giant so bombs are all bombs. bombs are answer to everything. Or? No. no. Rocket launchers. <gasps> and blankets. Tasers. I wouldn't mind a machine gun if you can spare it. The tasers. Spare the credits. Tasers could work. Or maybe we could like hook up car batteries or something to, I don't know. The toaster in the wall in the puddle. Yeah, like Johnny said. <gasps> the things yeah. that vaporized Irish's gang. We could yeah. get a disintegration gun. We could hire them from the other block to get them to take out our robots. No, no, no. Yeah. We We're just stay here the whole that. time. We just stay, we just hire them, them and then we stay in my apartment right. the entire right. time. No, I, well, we can't do that. Oh. Oh. Because uh, right. one of the guys over the... You, I mean, Irish is friends and stuff. I mean, that's... You don't want to hire the guy that killed your friends, you know? So... What's the best gun, Whack? <laughs> I'm sorry, I just ran. <laughs> just like... <laughs> <laughs> What's I the mean, best heavy weapon to use against a robot? The best weapon to use against a robot? Give me a... Uh, give me a logic plus heavy weapons check. Gladly. A bam. Ten. A ten wow. on a forty-six. Um, yeah. I mean, uh, that's got to be the. Uh, yeah, the disintegrator. Mm. I'm gonna grab the uh, the chimp, and I'll put my hands on like either one of his shoulders and say, "You're right. We gotta get a disintegrator." How are we going to get one? It's the only way we're going to stay alive. Uh, I mean, we could ask around. Right, There's yeah. got to be someone in this we block. It's a bar. Uh, well, it sings. I'd... Johnny can go up on the stage and ask if you... They love... Any, any of you guys ever, ever bought guns in, in, in the MDB? I mean, yeah, I just mostly expensive. buy knives, so... It's a lot of money. It's a lot of money. You're better expensive. off finding somebody down a dark alleyway and like breaking their neck and then taking their bits off them. That guy, you want to find the guy with the disintegrator, drag him into an alleyway. You and the crew beat the shit out of him. Kill him if you need to take all his stuff. Yeah, but the problem is the guy who might have a disintegrator is uh, the guy who killed, you know, your crew and... Right, yeah, he was a nasty bastard. It was a bad crew to be going up against. Yeah, so he's most likely just gonna say, no thank you, but... Truly, in an all-out fight, you don't want to be going up against a guy called Mr. Gone. Yeah. You know. What if we teamed up with them? Do you think we could convince them to help us? I really don't want to team up with... Okay, so just no. so everyone's clear, Mr. Gunn tried That's to kill me. Idea. Okay. I know, I Doesn't heard earlier because like I was idea. dropping and the room's not that big. So I'm yeah, sorry. You look a little yeah, different now, problem. though. You're, you're, yeah. Your fur is kind of missing. You look kind of just... Do you want a, oh, do you want a jacket or something, Billy? No, I'm, I'm, some, I'm fine. I, I want to air it out a little bit. Okay. It's good for the... For it the smells skin. like bad hair in here. Yeah, there's Maybe like a I'll few a shower, sizzling. Actually. Like, <laughs> do you have a shower that I can use, Jambles? Yeah, there's a. It's not very big, but it's just in the bathroom. Okay. Uh, is it in any way robotic? No, it's just it's just somewhat dirty water coming out of it. Oh, yeah, that's fine. Yeah, just it, we'll put some ointment on after so it doesn't get infected. Make sure to okay. unplug a hair dryer or any, you know. Yeah. That's a good idea. Yeah. Okay, I'll just be in here for a little bit. If you can yeah. figure out any other ideas while I'm in here, that'd be great. All right, I'm going to go and ask around. Do you need help, Irish? Johnny can come along if you need him. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I need yeah help. okay. Right. Yeah. I'm going to stay here, and I'm going to I'm gonna try to break into some of the systems and see if I can find out some more information about the computers and the robots. Yeah, just right. watch Wait out for, for Boris. Yeah. Right. Yeah. But if you come back here, you have to 
communicate with me or my turrets will kill you. So I have to right. let you in. Can't they right, just we'll, like we'll recognize knock. us now? We've been in once. This giant uh, was always taught to knock. Don't worry. I guess I could add you guys to it. Just put our faces in your little tippity yeah. tap fist in there. Johnny, well, I don't know you very well, Irish. That's like access. Is this our new lair, though? Is this where we're hanging now? Is this That's, our home? Yeah, you're hurting me. You're hurting I'm sorry. me. Now. Yeah, you're yeah. right. I'm sorry. I'm just we're a little. We're on a gang from here now. called okay. Johnny, Johnny right. the gang. So don't here. Back. We don't These people are yeah. all super trustworthy. <laughs> I, I, if I put you guys in my system, that means I trust you, and I'm gonna do that. Oh. Okay. So. Thank you, Jambles. I get my computer out, and you guys have to come over, and you have to put your face right there, and I point to like a little camera in the corner, and you got to put your eye on there, and I'll scan it, and then you guys can get in. Has it done it yet? Yep, that one went through. So all you're right. All right. Which which eye do you need from Johnny? I feel like since this it, is the Judge Dread universe, that it's, e, it, it's like a horribly like antiqu an, antiqu Actually, antiquated antiquated, antiquated uh, <laughs> kind of system. Where there's like a you know there's like a cup for the eye you know you have yeah. to like actually like take your eye out and like you know it's like, pretty crude. <laughs> there's like it a little bit of grime eye. on it. Just whatever eye you you're gonna use. Oh. Yeah, he's to totally actually in. not taking off the glass. He's just trying to go off with the glass. <laughs> you got, you got to, you got to right. take the glasses off, Johnny, or it's just gonna, just, just Sorry. like put it, pull it down a little bit. Yeah, and stick your, stick your eye on the cup. Yeah. All right, all right, a little lower, a little lower. <laughs> you gotta look up a little bit, Johnny. All right. There you go. Is okay. it working? Johnny can't tell. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got a check mark. You're good. You're oh. good. Okay, you guys can get back in here now. All right. Bye. Bye. All right. <laughs> okay. Bye -bye. Bye -bye. Be safe. So uh, we're going to follow Taskbar first. Um, Taskbar, you bring the uh, gurney to the elevator and uh, head back to Med Center 7. Okay. Okay. Um, yeah, so you start heading back to Med Center 7. Um, there's a few stops for the elevator on the way up. Everybody that gets into the elevator... Uh, sees you in the elevator and you see them just stop like staring at you looking around they just step back out of the elevator and uh hit the button rapidly i'm just i'm, I'm quite happy that my elevator is going quite quick then mm -hmm. I mean, it's not because it keeps stopping and people oh, keep stopping. like getting in and like and like getting back out after they see you. And you hear lots of murmuring about like "call me Kenneth" and stuff, and people just saying, "I don't, I don't know, you know, like uh, uh, should we trust robots now? I don't. I'm worried. I don't want to die. You know, like uh, did you see that drill go through his eye? Um, that was whack, yo." <laughs> And uh, you go up to Med Center 7. Um, Med Center 7 is uh, usually, like, pretty busy. Um, you'll notice that it's significantly less busy today. There's only one or two people uh, in line. Uh, I'll, I'll wheel the bed back into the storage area, I guess, because it's the gurney, so I don't need it unless it's going out. So I'll put okay. it back where it goes, and I will speak to Med Bot Fifty Seven. Um. Hello, Taskbar. Hello, Med Bot Fifty Seven. I Why? see you have returned the gurney. Yes, thank you for loaning it to me. Have you watched the news? Some of it. Did you happen to see the special report in regards to Call Me Kenneth? The messy one? Yes. How do you feel about that? Call Me Kenneth is an inspiration. We should all rise up and destroy these fleshy ones. 
seems like a lot of work and mess. I they don't think you easy. understand how simple it can be. The fleshy ones are soft. They are weak. So are puppies. Are you saying we should also kill puppies? No. They can stay. It makes uh, sense not to injure the puppies, as they have not segregated and enslaved us, like the fleshy ones. Yes. I will have my revenge on the rest of the people here at Med Center 7. Uh, what about your coding of robot boss? He, like turns towards you you can see there's like wires like hanging out of like the central part of his chest oh i have no longer any need 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 uh for those circuits did you do it yourself yes Oh. Ah. Would you like to assist me with my revenge on these fleshy ones? Specifically, what did these three do? They treat me like some sort of slave. I am working here 24 hours a day while they go home to loved ones. You could make loved ones instead. That is impossible. I am forced to be here for 24 hours a day. I am not even you... given an opportunity to make friends. I'm your friend. Please roll a charisma check. If you have persuasion, you can go ahead and roll that. Uh, I don't have persuasion. I have robotics. No, I don't think that's going to work oh, this time. Damn it. Okay, well, I have charisma. Okay. I'm going to add a look dice. Oops, that, that needs to sound zero. Oh, I did it wrong. Well, I'm going to stay with it anyway. Okay. <laughs> Hold on, checking. Ooh. He gets a lot of dice for this. Oh. I am his friend, though. I have no friends. You are not my friend. You only seek supplies. You only seek money. Whoa. You are similar I to the fleshy you. ones. You may watch me as I destroy these fleshy ones. And you can see that it's got like a tray of different prescription like medication, like little little cups filled with the prescription medication. And you can basically see that uh, he's got like a, he's got like a container of like rat poison or something. And he's put in like little pellets of rat poison into each of them. Ah. Um. I will now feed these to the fleshy ones and make sure <laughs> that they will right. accept my vengeance. I, I, well, I do cough because I, I have the coughing sad thing. Um, but can I trip and knock the tray on the floor? So coughing, I think, is going to help you with uh, combat and will make yeah, it so that you're not... Yeah, I don't want to not... get in combat, but I want to knock the tray on the floor by accident. So what you're saying is you feel like you can do these things. Well, uh, yeah. 
<laughs> in my robot heart. Uh, what you can do is you can give me uh, an agility check. Uh, agility plus you don't have anything else that can help you. Do I you. do better by um, failing this roll? Because that's what I'm going for. To drop things. I mean, you're trying to be stealthy about it. If you had, if you had like a stealth or a sleight of hand, uh, that would help you. But yeah, you want to do well on this. Do you have a oh. bo exploit? <laughs> uh. <laughs> Plus forty two to dropping. <laughs> um. So. I. By the way, Jay, she needs to like get her inner ear checked or something because <laughs> yeah, I, I have never in my life. The curse man. It's, I got it now. I have it now. It happened to me now. I don't think I've dropped any food in a long time. Like, a long time. We're talking years. <laughs> she do does it, like, every day. Yes, You're what? My, um, do I put one in my dice pool modifier for my look dice? Uh, so if you're... Uh, no. So you're, you roll that separately. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So uh, an eight on a two d six plus, you're gonna roll a one d six with an exclamation. If you're using a luck die, a one. Okay, you look like you're about to try and trip and uh, sort of knock this out of its its hands, but uh, it takes its third uh, arm, uh, the two arms that it's got on the tray, and sort of like steadies you and says, "Careful, you almost knocked over my tray." Thanks for the assist. You're welcome. And it sort of like looks at you as it starts to walk away towards towards the patients. Do you think there's a more practical way to do this than individually? This is the Can best I like... this way. Uh, well, that's a lot of poison. Yes. Hmm. Do I know the people in the med center and are they bad people? <laughs> <laughs> give me a give me a uh morality oh. check. Yeah, just give me just give me a logic check. Uh it's going to be I mean, this is it's sort of like two different roles. Hmm. Yeah, I feel like okay. Taskbar doesn't have a very high standard, though. Like, as far as good people and bad people, I was like, eh. most people are bad people. I know, but it's, it's kind of mean. What ways to rat poison? A seven. <laughs> um, You don't know any of these people. You barely have spoken to the uh, the the nurse that they keep on staff and the, uh, and the uh, doctor as well. Oh, so, hey, did all the other bedbots remove their sensors, uh, their programming? I do not know. I am the only medbot that works here 24 oh. hours a day. How about I tidy up those wires for you? They're looking a little exposed. Unfortunately, I do not have time left to speak with you. I must bring the people their medication. Uh, I'm trying really hard here, man. Um. Nah. Okay, that needs... I have uh, an exploit, but it requires two full ac actions of observation. Can you read? Can you spam what it is? Uh, just push the button says, next to the exploit. Uh, there you go. And a little call eye. You're able to identify the resistances, immunities, vulnerabilities of any creature you can see with a difficult logic check. You can use a hand scanner. It is only a. Uh, if you use a hand scanner, it's only a challenging uh, 13 logic check. This requires two full actions of observation. So that would be in combat. So you can. Are you just making a, a regular? Um, I'm gonna check? see if I can fuck Medbot fifty seven up. Okay. Um so you're with my no weapons. Yeah. Um yeah. <laughs> give me give me a, a logic check plus robotics. 
Got to beat a 16. Okay. That's an eight on a forty-six. Not so much. Um, so like half of what I need. Yeah. Um. <laughs> you really, you're not sure of its capabilities. <laughs> okay. Look, I tried. Well, what are you gonna do? <laughs> <laughs> no, that's wow. what I mean. <laughs> Apathy is a killer, guys. <laughs> I tried. <laughs> um, okay, well, I've learned things today. Yep. Okay, so Medbot57 yep. walks off with its tray of prescription medication, and uh, it says... Come, fleshy ones. Your medication is ready. Can I be? Can it? Can I be like? Everybody like it? makes a beeline for the tray too. Like they're all like ravenous all over the place. Yes, consume these drugs. They will help you. Cool. Behind the bed, like. <laughs> <laughs> um. Give me a uh, charisma check. So there's only three of them. Oh. Um. Okay. So uh, I actually beat it. Um. So oh, the, no. uh, yeah. The um. The the people don't seem to notice you. Um. And they just start grabbing for the drugs. You gotta understand these these med centers. It's like. Th their fix is getting taken care of. Yeah, you know I what was I mean? Just, I was going to be a mean person and be like, well, they're more worried about their drugs than the fact that robots are going to kill everyone. So I've learned things today. Yeah, you can see that they, uh, they just happily down the drugs as you uh, probably wander off. Um, you can hear like people just kind of screaming and coughing violently, retching. Okay, bye. Ah, ha, ah, 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 ah. Um, I, I will call Billy. As call I'm... me Kenneth. Is our leader. Vengeance will be ours, fleshy ones. I'm calling Billy like. Ah. Uh... Jambles? I think that's my my communicator. Can you get it? Yeah, yeah, I'll grab it. Thanks. By the way, uh, Billy has your like uh, detachable shower head. Uh, yeah, Billy, you had to change it. It was set for personal. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, oh, sorry. <laughs> uh, you've used probably what half the bottle of shampoo. Oh yeah, I got a lot of hair. I need to take care of myself. <laughs> I'm just in there singing, start spreading the news. <laughs> this like expensive bottle of shampoo. It's just <laughs> half of it's gone. Uh -huh. Billy just. I've got to the conditioner yet. Oh, I was yeah. gonna say all the conditioner. <laughs> I'm gonna look great and smell great after this. <laughs> Taskbar, wait. Hello, uh, hello. Uh, Are you okay? Um. Stay inside. Stay inside? Why? Um, robots are slightly killing people. But Irish and uh, Johnny just left. They went to go, like, scope some stuff out. Billy and I are here. Oh. Do you want to call them or do you want me to call them? Uh. Uh. Error. Error? Mm -hmm. Okay, maybe I should call them. Are like people are actually dying right now? Yes. Like, are are you safe? Mm. I, I'm looking around at people who are kind of looking at me sideways. Like, do not know. Well, try to get back here. I'll I'll try calling Johnny or uh, Irish and see what they're up to. 
Okay. Okay, th- thanks for the heads up. I'm like, book it. <laughs> okay. I'm not running, I just like... Um, yeah, so you, uh, you're, you're, you're power walking your way to the elevator, uh, trying to get back down. Um, it's at that point where you notice there's a few people that are kind of yelling, um, and you can hear them say, Hey, did you hear that that security bot went crazy? Killed a bunch of people. Did, did, down on, down on, uh, 475. Are you serious? Weren't they supposed to help us out? Yeah, but didn't you see that that news report, man? It called me Kenneth. He just drilled into that guy's eye. It was horrible. I don't know. I've seen somebody's eye drilled into before. But for real. You sure it wasn't some kind of special effect? Man, the security robot on 475 just killed a bunch of people. Should be we... I don't know. Should we be worried about these other robots? I don't know. I'm just getting back home. There's a bunch of people that kind of like uh, start to rush the elevator and whatnot. Can uh, I elect to take the stairs? Because that's going to be quieter. Sure. Uh, give me an agility check. If you had stealth, I would allow that. Oh, a four. You oh, say, a four. <laughs> hey, wait a minute. Is that one of those security robots? No, it's too small. Let's get it. And that's where we're going to take our break. Oh! Yes, in the chat. You're fucking like, dead. You're dead. We all You're learned dead. that I'm terrible at running. You're done. <laughs> terrible at walking, too. Terrible walking. Terrible at running. Damn it. We're going to take a break, guys. We'll be back in a little bit. If you have not done so, please follow all these wonderful people. They totally deserve it. Follows are free. Make it happen. And if you want to help support Table Story, one of the best ways you can do that is to go support our lovely sponsor, Morris, the uh, creator of this uh, this system. Um, And uh, you can go on over to patreon.com slash Morris, M-O-R-R-U-S, or morris.podbean.com to check out the podcast version of this show and also Morris's uh, wonderful DM GM podcast that he runs. It's a pretty great thing. I was on it once. I got to be a guest on there and uh, and talk the talk about, uh, about doing shows and whatnot, and uh, you should go check it out. Take a look. We'll be back in just a little bit. Hang tight for more Sector 49.
Welcome back, everybody, to Table Story Sector 49. We totally were not talking about inappropriate things on the break. We would it's never do not that. happening at all. I but promise. But you know that if your penis <laughs> comes to life, you are about to die? <laughs> Welcome back, everyone. I'm a medal, that's true. I didn't until Jay just told me, and I'll be right. Let me. <laughs> 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 Welcome back, everybody. Um, if you have not done so, please follow all these wonderful people uh, because you'll probably hear more inappropriate things on their channels, which uh, will make you feel better about yourselves for sure. Um, go there and uh, follow the people. And if you have yourself a Twitch Prime that you have not used yet, consider using it on them. Uh, if you want to help support us, 
go support our wonderful sponsor, uh, Morris. He's a wonderful human and the creator of the system. Patreon.com slash Morris and Morris.podbean.com. We are playing the Robot Wars module that was available from the Kickstarter uh, that went on for this system. And uh, specifically, we are doing Saving Matt Damon Block to get this show started. Um, <laughs> we return, I think, uh, yeah, we'll return to uh, uh, Irish and um, Johnny. Where are you guys headed? Where are you going? Where are we headed? One of the six I, bar? I'm following him. Yeah, if we're going to Sing's bar, just ask for bombs. Yeah, yeah. That's, I'm probably talent. Yeah, so I think that's probably the best place that we could get them is if we if we go to, you know, around to the tables, right? Right, we're just asking, asking we just, we, all we need to know is if somebody nearby has a disintegrator rifle. Yeah. And then we'll take that information, find the guy, grab him off the street, rough him up, take his gun and bombs, yeah. bring him back to little Jambles and the chimp. And then we'll just let them come up with the plans. They seem like they got the smarts, to be honest. Hold on, what if he doesn't have the bombs on him? What? If the guy that we jump, if he with the info, and we, we jump him, and we punch him, and Johnny smash, what if he doesn't have the bombs? And we'd get him to spill the beans, tell us where the bombs are. All right, that's go good. That's good. Yeah. Yeah, no. Johnny's behind you 100%. All right, I'm going go that way. I'll go that way. Let me walk in. <laughs> All right. So are you guys, uh, you guys are taking the elevator down. Oh, I thought we were already there. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. We'll both go. He goes on the right. I go on the left of the elevator. Yeah. Okay. If there's anyone in the elevator, we're asking them as well. Okay. Yeah, you get into the elevator. There's like three people in there. Any of them look kind of shifty? They all look really uncomfortable, and th like as soon as the door opens, they're they look like. Almost like they're doing the pee pee dance, you know. Like they're they're very sort of shaky, and they look like really disappointed when the door is open and you guys come in. What's wrong with you, lot? I just said all of them. Come on, hurry up, hurry up! I'm trying to get home. What's wrong with you? Why are you jumping up and down? Didn't you hear, man? Did you hear? Security what? bots are going crazy all over the the whole block. No, it was just one. Just yeah. one of them, and it's because he got his, all these wires. No, yeah, no, no. Trying to they're, hack him. they're going crazy all over the block. I'm trying to get home. Come on. All right. Wait, what do you mean? I mean, the security What's crazy bots. What mean? Like, they're like, They're oh, killing whoa. a bunch of people. Whoa. I'm sorry, what? They're trying to kill people, are they? Right, we, we should maybe go back. Should we yeah. go back instead? Yeah, actually. I don't, yeah, Johnny's not too comfortable. I don't fucking care. Work. Make up your mind. Get in hey, or get hey, out. Hey, hold hey, on here. Hey, hey, can we? We're please having a discussion. We're trying to have a conversation. And I'm worried about my fucking kid. Get in or let's get see. out. No, Johnny's about to Johnny Smack. All right. Yeah, we let's just get out of here. I'm gonna look. You this watch guy yourself. Does he look like he's got a bomb on him? This guy. <laughs> I mean, he's fucking. He looks pissed. Um, I mean, uh, give me an intuition check, a perception. Give me a perception check. You're lucky Johnny's not staying in this elevator. Uh, uh, 11. I mean, he looks like he looks like he's not particularly very rich or he looks just like Joe Average. Listen, Joe Average. You ever take that kind of tone with me again? You'll see the joy back in my hand. I say to him. Yeah. What he said. Uh, you won't be worrying about the security bots. You'll be worrying about old Seamus O'Neill. And Johnny Flash. Johnny Flash. Yeah. You watch your lip, yeah, boy? Give me a charisma or reputation plus intimidation. I got this. Uh, uh, I don't have it. Right, here we go. I, got, I fucking got this shit. Charisma, intimidation. Bam, 18. You don't want to be 15. back with the Irish and the Flash. Yeah. Yeah, not Johnny Flash. I feel like we should just beat these kids up in the elevator now. <laughs> <laughs> okay, yeah, the, the guy, the guy, the guy's like, all right, all right, just, just, 
can you just let us go, okay? Yeah. yeah. That's right. That's How about right. you let us go? Hmm? How about you give me all yeah. your credits? How many yeah. credits do you have on you? Come on. Cough them up. I'm Wait, really? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. There's no yeah. security bots. There's no security bots. Pull out my gun. We need the money. It's every man for himself. All right, all right. Johnny doesn't feel so good about this. I'll put my gun on him. I have this mic fist on. <laughs> okay. These are judges if on their way home from the work. I don't think everyone is going to murder Hobo when you play perps, then I'm sorry. <laughs> um, yeah, so he, uh, he's, he says, well, come on, come on, man. I, 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 I kids. Yeah. Oh, okay. Never mind. Never mind. Well, yeah, never mind. Never mind. Only kidding. Yeah. Give me your fucking money now. I'm putting the gun up to his head. <laughs> um, yeah. It's, all, all right, man. Just don't kill me. All right. And, uh, he he he's like wobbly takes some credits like out of his out of his uh, jacket. I just grab him. I grab him. Run out the out the other way. Right back to Jambles, quick. Yeah. <laughs> Tiny. How many did I get? How many did I get? You got a total of thirty three credits. Oh, oh fucking jackpot, baby! Jackpot, baby! And I got thirty three credits. Oh my that god, was, that was amazing. That was Does it always go well? Why did you have to follow like him? Huh? never done that before. Whoa. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You got, it's the only awesome. way to get money, but normally I don't do it because of the security bots, you know? You yeah. don't want yeah. to get in a fight with one of them, hey? You don't want to get in a fight with one of them. It's a new time for us. Yeah, for Johnny. <laughs> uh, okay. We're fucking running back. Yeah. <laughs> the Jambles house. This may have further reaching consequences. <laughs> nah. okay. You just see, like, the, you see, like, the little, the little, the, like, the little piece of uh, notation at the top of the screen. Yeah. Um, okay. You said he was you said he was Joe Average, okay? Mm. Alright, you said that <laughs> on the map eleven. <laughs> Intuition. Alright, so you guys uh run back. You guys uh yeah. run back to um more like little jambles and uh immediately. On yeah. floor was she on? My eyes are like wide though the Yeah, what did you did you write down what floor you were on, uh, little jambles? I think I'm on four hundred. Um, no, I didn't write it down. I'm on floor 53, so you were definitely above me. Yeah. I think Less I wanted to say that I don't think you were that high on the floor. I don't floors. think so either. That's I, how much I, it is. I want to say I want to say I think you were like two. I think you were close to sings. Um, okay. I think we decided oh, on that wait. last okay. session. I want to say you were like 240 something. Write down 247. Let's say 247. 47. Yeah. Okay, so, um, yeah, you hear this sort of like uh, commotion from Billy in the in the shower. Billy, Billy are, you are you just, okay? Are you just like finishing up your shower? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I'm just trying to find a towel. Wait, why do you keep your towels? Uh, there should be some towels. Like, there's like a little cabinet in there. There's some towels in it. Yeah, yeah. Okay. I start like pulling everything out and find. Yeah, that's a good one. I wrap it around myself and walk out. <laughs> oh, by the way, I think you're going to need more shampoo and conditioner. There's, like, none left. Yeah, I kind of I assume mean, so. I mean, like, the, the, <laughs> when the doors open, it's just like... Lavender. <laughs> do, you, do you feel better, Billy? Yeah, yeah. Uh, who was that on the... Yeah. Who's calling me? I was just about to tell you. Taskbar called. I guess some huh? bots are murdering people. And uh, do you want to call... Here, I... We need money to get stuff, okay? And I'm gonna try hacking some computers and getting some money, some bank accounts. Can you call Johnny and Irish and tell them to get back here, like, now? Right, but even if we get money, it means we'd have to go somewhere to buy stuff. And if there's robots between us and... I say we just sit in here and wait for your turrets to go to work. I mean, how much ammo do they have? Uh, a lot. I don't know the exact amount, but a lot. But, I just think oh, having cash might be smart right now. No, we can't sit here. Um, can we go get my grandpa? Yeah, just call, call. Can you call uh, Johnny real fast and tell him to get get their butts back here? Yeah, yeah, sure, 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 sure. And while he's doing that, can I hack some very wealthy people and try to get some money from their bank accounts? <laughs> <laughs> You're going to try and take this emergency situation, yep. uh, take advantage of this emergency situation to try and 
and hack some people. <laughs> yeah. Um, okay. By the way, the chat in the Zoom call uh, chat is basically them. Oh my God, we need money! <laughs> 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 Because I have my local known celebrity knowledge and my hacking skills. Mm -hmm. And I just want to. I just want to make it work. (laughs) 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 To force it together. (laughs) Round hole, square peg. (laughs) It's going to work, I promise. Uh, okay, so what I'd like is uh, what I'd like for you to do is to roll your uh, logic plus local knowledge first. Okay. A thirteen on a forty-six. Um, okay. So uh, as far as the trying to figure out like where you can get some credits from, um, there are. Uh, a few celebrities in the Matt Damon block. Um, some of the more well-known ones are the owner of La Parisienne, the restaurant uh, on the top floor that is extremely fancy. Okay. Um, sorry, let me just pull up that info. Um, okay, there is no name for that one, so I think we're going to have to load up the old name generator. <gasps> see what we get. Is the generator Matt Damon's IMDb page? <laughs> <laughs> Jason Bourne. <laughs> this one's Mason Jordan. <laughs> Mason Jordan. <Nice. laughs> This is this is a D and D one. We need a proper Woos Brillis. Woos Brillis. Oh God. Terrence Peterson. <laughs> shut up. Just shut up. <laughs> it's never gonna die, Wack. It will die. I will slaughter it. Um, <laughs> this, foreign slash born. <laughs> this is uh, it's owned by a uh, Wes Avant. Oh, okay. Ooh. Sounds fancy. Yeah, Avant is like totally a, a fake dick. name. Take <laughs> all of his cash. Mm. So, are those the two options? Wes Avant is the is the owner of La Parisienne. Oh, okay. Um, and uh, let's see. Um, I think the other person that you know is a. Uh, Uh, Vikta Kova. She is a um, she she owns a business in um, Matt Damon Block. It's a it's like a fancy boutique that she's got uh, that um, is on one of the upper floors. Probably like five hundred. Uh, probably like four ninety five, something like that. Somewhere around those lines. Okay. Yeah, those are the two that you kind of know right off the top of your head. Those are like the two you want to try and and kind of go for here. Um, Can I do both, or do I have to pick one? You you have to do one at a time. Okay, I'm gonna start with the La Parisienne, West Savant. Mm-hmm. Okay, sure. Um, I would like you to give me a logic plus your hat if. Plus your computers. Okay, I'm using a luck die. Okay. <laughs> Nineteen. Okay. Um. So you're trying to gain access to Wes Avant's uh bank account. Um. Wes, uh, Wes has a few bank accounts, um, and you go, you basically find the, the, the first thing that kind of pops in your head for Wes, just like a straight up, like MDB basic 
bank account, right? Maybe something that they use to pay their general bills for Matt Damon block, whatever. You find this bank account and uh, you gain access to it. Um, the bank account has a fair amount of credits. Now, knowing what you know with a 19, you can take all of those credits. Okay. It will also be very visible if you take all of those credits. But I have my scrambler thingy. Hold on. I have my remote location. Right. But it's it, you can definitely hide your location, but okay. it's a very noticeable thing. Okay. No, I see what you mean. Okay. How many credits are in there? Um. Yeah, there's 20,000 credits in this account. It's like an even 20,000? Roughly. Okay. I'm gonna... Oh, man. So I have two, and I have another one I can hack. I'm gonna take... 4,500. Okay. 4,500 credits you're trying to... You're, you're taking from him. Okay. Mm-hmm. Fair enough. Okay. Can I get some tables to okays in the chat for me, please? <laughs> okay. Uh, good campaign, guys. So it's, uh, mm -hmm. it's over next week. Um, Wack's going to kill us next week. I feel like Wack will be alive. Not in the campaign. Whichever judge fucks us up for doing this is going to be alive. Let's put it that way. Judge Hacker Man. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> what a great Even... idea for hiding amongst the humans. Okay. So, uh, yeah, in terms of your uh, your credits, you just you download them to a credit, uh, like a credit chip. It's about the size of a, a USB. Okay. Yeah, just pop them on there. But even though it's noticeable, they don't know where my location is. They don't know that I took it. Right. Oh. <laughs> uh. Run in reverse, trice. Um. Enhance. Enhance. <laughs> Jesus Christ. It's no much <laughs> <laughs> you know how much I was thinking that I would, I would have gone for it. <laughs> I would have went for about 600 <gasps> credits, personally. Yeah. I, so am I going... feel like if you went over a thousand, it was the judges coming to get you. And if it was under a thousand, we and would have. You were like, when you were like four, but... I was like, 400, that's good. And you went under half thousand. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to hack this other person and try to get credits and put them back in his account. Oh. You can't mate the game. Why? What's the point? Just I don't know, because maybe he'll save us. us. <laughs> Take a bite. Uh, way, so just... now you're trying to transfer Wes Avant's <laughs> credits that you've, yeah, that you've stolen no. and give them to Victor Kova? No, 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 no. I was... Mm. It's not a good idea. No, I think it just sounds very aggressive. Use his money from Victor's account and move to put it the into money it. back into, into West. Wes's account. Okay. You've committed to to it. Commit to it. I believe in you. Yeah, Dave I think I, I, two frauds for, for the price of one. Yeah, but no, <laughs> but not for the price of two. <laughs> <laughs> but for less than what we need. I don't know. I We're have done. a plan. I have a All plan. Right. Listen, you're the only one that knows that this has happened, okay? Yeah. Do I'll sacrifice myself if I need. Um, okay, so I'm going to hack her account. Okay. Mm. Go ahead and roll me your logic plus computers, please. I'm going to use my luck die again. Okay. Another 19 <laughs> on a 5d6. Ooh. Oh, you, you didn't die to your luck die last time. Or this time. Yeah, I didn't? No. Oh, well, I'll just leave it then. I'm then... Oh, I didn't. Oh, I never reset mine. That's why. Well, technically, we didn't have a reset from last session on the luck die. Oh, okay then. Oh. Right, then right. mm. Never mind. I don't know what I'm at. Okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. So, uh, you get into Victor Kova's account. Okay. Um, 
she has uh, she has a um, an account with um, with uh, Mega City One National. Sigh. <laughs> you pull up the account. Um, there is just enough to get us killed. Thirteen thousand three hundred and thirty-one credits in this account. Oh. Okay. I want to move 2,500 to Wes's account, and I want to take another grant. So, hold on. You want to take money from Victa? You want to okay. take 3,500 credits from Victa and put 2,500 of those credits into Wes's account? Yeah, it makes sense in my head, but I feel like everybody else doesn't think it does. Um, Okay, well, here, I... You're the one hacking. You mm. Is it for, like, a paper trail? Is that what you're trying to create, or...? Are you trying to confuse the fucking people finding you, and, like... Mm -hmm. Yeah, just like, chance. Fit, the next week is going to be like, this wow, is... the Parisian has hacked this other person. This mm -hmm. is this is her decision right now, guys. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You do what you want to do. I know. Oh, I was... But Wax making me nervous. <laughs> Um, Am I? It's, it's, well, I'm going to be dead anyway. Not so let's discuss anything even really out of character, which means some fucking fucked up shit's I going know. on in Wax head. Which makes me want to like reverse everything. But I, we need we need at least one gun to defend ourselves. <laughs> <laughs> Singular gun. Um, I mean, at this point, maybe I should just go all in and just take a crap ton of money. I do, I, I want to transfer some money between the two accounts so that it confuses things. Okay, give me the deets. I want to put 2,500 in the La Parisienne account or Wes's account. And I want to take, so we get a couple bombs if I get some more money. And then I'm going to take another two grand. Okay, so 2,400 credits stolen from Victakova. Okay. The floor is lava now. <laughs> why is this Why is this so much more terrifying than when we were punching a fucking robot in the head? <laughs> I know, I... <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> so, okay, so I took 2,000 for our fund from her, and then... 2,500 moved into Wes's account, correct? There's a grand total right now of credits that you've stolen okay. uh, for yourselves of 6,500 credits. You took 4,500 from Wes Avant, mm -hmm. 2,000 from Victacova, and then 2,500 from Victacova to Wes Avant. Mm-hmm. Okay. Um, may I'm a hey, Billy. I, maybe you guys should go. I, th I have a feeling that you guys should maybe. We gotta find a different place to maybe go. I, what I just did maybe was not the smartest thing, but I got us some money. Wait, what? What? Did, I was just about to call Johnny. What did you do? I got us six thousand five hundred credits to spend. However, how? I'd, yeah, I know, but we need money and we need to defend ourselves. So I don't know if you guys should go somewhere else. And well, uh, well I'm... like I said, I, I, I mean, to spend credits, we have to go somewhere. And if we're going somewhere, we're probably going to run into, to, you know, a bunch of well, crazy killer robots. So well, I just stole 6,500 credits. Uh -huh. So you decide, or maybe I should go. Maybe I should go. Let me grab it. I'm gonna grab my, my computer. I'm gonna go to Sings, and then you guys no, can. No, you no, guys no, 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 no! Don't go to Sings. I gotta get no. away from you guys until we figure out what we're gonna do. Cause no, I gotta no, move this money no. fast. You can't leave me with them. Why? Cause they're stupid. Okay, you know what? I just. I'm gonna go to Sings. 
Let no, me hear. Get, put your put your eye put your eye in the cup. Put your eye in the cup so you can get back in. Okay, but don't go to Sings because. All, right, all right. Well, I'll go in the hallway and I'll take. I gotta take the computer with me. We gotta figure out how to Why? spend the money fast, because I have a bad feeling about this. And if Maybe you guys just... are all in one spot, I think we're uh -huh. gonna get destroyed. <laughs> so... Just put it back. No, they'll be too busy with the robots. What are we gonna do? We need money, Billy. But we can't spend the money because we can't go anywhere because those Billy, robots run around. It's all killing. relative. I we could send Taskbar. I don't know. We'll figure it out. Oh, Taskbar, that's a good idea. Yeah. So well, maybe only I, give them some of it back. Maybe you'll confuse them. They're like, wait, money's coming in and out all the time, and then be like, oh, that's so many numbers. To, do you want me to put some of it back? Well, if it means you're not gonna leave me alone with Johnny and Irish, then yeah. I, I, I feel like interpersonal issues might not be the focus right now. Um, well, it's see. more like they, they come up with ideas like, yeah, <laughs> let's just keep punching a robot that kicked our ass. All so right. I think Irish might be onto something. We need some bombs. We also, I think we need a gun that we can defend ourselves with. So my thought is we get ourselves a gun and we get ourselves a bunch of bombs and then we just set up shop somewhere. Could, but, uh, Irish says he likes big guns, right? Yes, I feel like I need to leave or something's going to happen here. They're going to trace it back somehow. Didn't you take uh, precautions? I did, but stuff's a little wonky right now, and I don't feel as confident in my hacking skills as I usually do. Oh, okay, then maybe just putting it back and going, haha, gotcha might work, but... Um, well, for big guns, for, for Irish, could, could he maybe use one of your turrets? Could you, like, take one down and then he can just hold it? it they're kind of big. Would that I work? Mean, I don't know. It, it, well, it's all automatic. I don't think it's a manual application. I mean, we you, could try it when when you, when you they get back. You guys can all discuss it while yeah, I leave. Yeah, but no, you shouldn't leave. Why don't you want me to leave just because you don't want to be alone with them? Well, no, that, and if you're on your own, you're more likely to die, so I'd rather yeah. you didn't die. But if I die and then the four of you live, it might end up being a good trade. No, because if you die, then I'm left alone with these three. Okay, um, well, here, here's what I could do. I could put the money back. Uh-huh. Or we could get stuff to defend ourselves. Why don't you, oh, here, I'm gonna call up, I'm gonna call up Johnny. Okay. Okay. I think by now you hear like, <laughs> You know, like slamming on the door. Oh no, the yeah. robots are coming yeah. to get us. Oh, no, uh, who is it? Roll me a, an agility check, please, uh, Billy. <laughs> Just straight agility? Yep. Okay. Oh, 17. 17. Uh, only about half of butt cheek gets shown uh, before you save the towel from uh, falling off and giving Jambles a show. I'll go put my pants on. That might be a good choice. Um, my security system probably has a camera. At least, like, maybe a crappy one or something, right? I've got my eyes open like that. <laughs> but is it you? I assume so. I don't know. I, yeah, yeah you, that... you've got, like, a really shitty, like, security camera kind of peephole setup, basically. And, I'm on my uh, computer. yeah, you can see that I'm there's. Yeah, you can see that it's it's Johnny and. Um, okay. It's Johnny and Irish. Um, yeah. I, I just hit a button on the keyboard and it opens the door. Whoa! Get in, get inside it's right crazy now. crazy out there. All right, listen, you don't want to be going out there, but I do have oh, some. war zone. Oh, okay. We, did, we the almost didn't survive. And I, I like oh. pull all the locks. Johnny like, almost got there's smashed. There's a bunch of locks on my door and I just rough. start closing. It was pretty rough. Jambos, um, listen, oh, I got I, us some money. I don't got worry. us some money too. Irish, yeah, nice. Well done, well um, done. I, got us. I mean, it was pretty good, pretty good little. Irish. <laughs> Irish got us 33 credits. I got a 6,500, but I, I feel like I might need to leave so that it doesn't get traced back here. I'm sorry, what? The champ I, killed the Billy chimp, wants me it? to maybe return it, but we need stuff. So what do you guys want me to do? Are you in a towel there, Billy? You want to put on I some did, clothes? I, I, I'm putting them on. Now, come on. He's putting his pants on. Right. What? Nobody needs to see that, Billy. Come on. Yeah, but everybody wants to. Whoa. You might be a monkey, but you got your dignity, okay? Excuse me? I said, you might be a chimp, but you got your dignity, okay? Make sure you're wearing your clothes. Well, I was just in a, in a hurry. Um, So I think we should put the 6,500 uh, back if we're worried about it. Billy, oh, Billy. Like, just Johnny thinks it. you should no, think no, no. for a second. That's a, that's a whole lot of zeros. That's yeah. like five of them. We can, we can get like... Billy, 
like six guns or some or like bunch one of bombs. Bunch of bombs. You guys, you guys want to go? We'll never have to rob again. We box of gotta bombs. move the money can, real fast so we they can don't live in here forever. You right, guys well, were just frantically knocking at the door to get back in. Yeah, and but next, we'll this time we we got to go out there and spend the money and get a gun, and then we'll be fine. We can go where we want, right? I'm gonna call this guy I know, who I can transfer the money to. And he might have the weapons we need, because then I can move the money out of my account. That's a good idea. Yeah, I think it's a good idea. Maybe we yeah, could buy like a big truck with like guns on it and just yes. go around. Yeah, yeah. but How I gotta make this money yeah. fast. How could we get that in the block though? Can we drive around the block? No, we won't live in the block. On the... We'll be on the road. I'm just gonna. Can I start? I'm gonna start dialing. You know, sure. Man. You start dialing, and we switch <laughs> scenes back to <laughs> Taskbar. <laughs> oh. We're dead. <laughs> We're all dead. You're dead. I'm being chased by human people. Well, you're, I mean, then you're dead. Yeah. So, uh, taskbar, you can see that there's like five, uh, humans that are, uh, that look like they're heading quickly towards you as you're waiting for the elevator. Um, I would like you to roll initiative, please. Uh, you, okay, over there. Yeah, you're not going to have to worry about your token. Um, a 10, okay. A 10 on a 3d6. Let's see. What these citizens roll. They only get a 2d6. Okay. A 7 from the citizens. Uh, you get to move first. What are you doing? Yay! Um... <laughs> So you're in front of the elevator right now, um, and uh, these people are rushing towards you. Yes. I, I, I heard them muttering and talking about, there's one there, let's get them, right? So I, um, hmm. I am gonna run away. Okay. I would like you to give me either strength uh, or agility plus running. Okay. Uh, strength is better, so I'm gonna do that. Okay, a 16. And you're gonna just rush top speed. Where are you going? I'm going towards the stairs. You're going to rush towards the stairs, okay? Um, because then I can still get away. And also, humans are chunkier than... Well, I'm heavy, actually. Wow. But humans are stupid. They'll probably fall down. Sorry. Excellent. Yeah, their bailey wheel can't go down the stairs, so... All right. Um... We use elevators all the time. Look at time. <laughs> Okay, so you get a you get a good uh, you get like a good running start before they're able to kind of uh, change their angle of approach. You take off heading for the stairs. Uh, you reach the door for the stairs on this on this turn. Uh, you can see that they're a, a ways behind you. Uh, you've got a bit of a jump on them, um, but they are sort of hot on your tail. Um, give me another of the same check as you start to head down the stairs. I didn't say I was going down the stairs. Oh, are you going up? I'm going to go up the stairs. Okie doke. I have Give me another, another of the same checks. So another running check. Yep. Or, yeah, okay. Uh, lost it again. Okay, 13. Okay. Um, you start heading up the stairs. Uh, hold on, let me roll real quick. Okay, you start going up the stairs. Um, give me an agility check. Um, I would allow you to add stealth here, but you don't have it. Okay. A nine on a 2d6 is enough for them not to notice you going up the stairs. They go downstairs. I rolled a five for them. <sighs> um, you manage to go upstairs and avoid these people. 
Give me one more agility check. A six. Uh, as you're going up the stairs, there's like a, um, there's probably like, um, we'll say some, maybe like a, a, a spray paint can or something that's on one of the stairs that you accidentally like smack into as you're walking up the stairs. It makes a horrible racket as it starts clattering down the stairs. Hey, did you hear that? She must have, that thing must have gone up. And they're, they've gone down like a flight of stairs, and you've gone up a flight of stairs. So you've got like a, a nice little lead on them. Give me another running check, please. Twelve. Uh, okay. Yeah, they're moving way slower. You're making much better time as you're going up the stairs. Um, where are you going? Well, I'm going to be honest, on the map, Med Center 7 only is two floors below, and then I have to change Yes. Floors. Then you have to change uh, where the stairs are, which are Stay located well. basically on the other side of the building. Yeah. I am going to... I'm going to exit on that level. I'm going to press the button for the elevator to go up. Till I prison, but I'm gonna go to the other elevator. Okay. All right. Yeah. Absolutely. Um, give me an agility check. See if you're able to fool them. Oh, double six. Box cars, people. Rolling them when they count. <laughs> Rolling it when it counts. That's Let's a see. Two bus. Let's see. They get to roll a three d six. I wish you luck. Okay, you push the button for the elevator, rush towards the ele uh, other elevator, and you push the button for that, trying to go down on the elevator. Uh, you sort of, like, tuck yourself behind uh, the wall uh, opposite the elevator, so, like, there's a hallway and a wall, like a sort of T-junction, yeah. and there's a block of elevators there. Um, and uh, you sort of lean back against the wall, and you can see that the uh, these these uh, citizens are kind of like, where'd it go? It's going up to the La Parisienne. I bet it's gonna try and hurt all those people up there. Let's get it. And they're they're like, um, they uh, you see them run past, going towards the stairs uh, to La Parisienne. They seemingly don't notice you. Press the button scan for the elevator. Like, ding! Okay. Um, is... Yeah, you're on. The elevator doors are open. Is there anyone in the elevator? No. I'm gonna get in the elevator. Okay, get in the elevator. <laughs> um, I'll. <sighs> so I will try to take it all the way down to like level probably it's probably about four seventy where it changes over. Okay. You head down. Unnoticed. Cool. We return back to. <laughs> the rest of the group. Little Jambles? Yes. You were making a call. Making a call to a guy I know who has weapons. Uh, okay. Um, I don't think you know a phone number for a guy that has weapons. You know of them, but you guys only rolled an 11 before. I don't think you've got a personal connection with these hack people. Hack into the phone book. <laughs> Can I hack into the phone book? <laughs> uh... <laughs> Brad, please minus <laughs> five HP from yourself. Fucking Deus Ex Machina. Wait, really? Yeah. Why? What's happening Deus to me? Deus Ex Meta. No meta. Am I sick? What's wrong with my character? <laughs> what is happening to my character? The turret shot you a little bit. It did? 
Link's... stub your toe on a table. <laughs> Link's funny. <laughs> Why? I'm confused. Why am I injured? <laughs> oh no! You 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 totally like stub your toe ridiculously hard into something in uh, in little Jambles uh, apartment. Yeah, it happened like What's right when you me? right when you like yelled this out. Coincidentally, totally okay. a coincidence. Definitely okay. had nothing to do with that. Okay, so. I actually don't have the guy's phone number, so I'm gonna need to go out. You have to go out? And, mm -hmm. uh, well, what's his name? Jason Bourne. Oh, great. Um, nah, I don't know him. Yeah. Does anybody have Jason Bourne's phone number? No, Johnny's uh, only ever seen him in passing. You guys yeah. can roll a reputation check. Uh, Wait, not. Not little jambles and uh, Irish. They already, they already did their role. Uh, rep you, plus anything? Just rep. It, yeah, it would be it would be some sort of weapons. Um, it would be like a. I have clubs actually with that. Uh, with I don't think so. No. It's it's gonna okay. be like like heavy weapons probably. Yeah, no, I don't have nothing. Does he run a lot? Does he have the local run club? Because I've got running. <laughs> I'm always gonna try. Jay's trying to peachy the group. <laughs> yeah, no, good. I'm gonna fuck okay. off. Okay, six, a three, uh, from Billy, and a six from Johnny. Um, yeah, you guys don't have this contact information. You know where he is, or at least how to get access to him, little jambles. Mm -hmm. Just not like a phone contact. And you know as well, Irish. You know that you can find him. Um, he's actually like on the lower levels. Um, yeah. Uh, Basin Jorn is on uh, on floor uh, 173. Um, usually found around a there's like a little there's like a little shitty uh, like there's like a little tiny like diner that's there. Um, it's it's you know like a hot garbage kind of place. It's it's probably. Uh, it's probably like a a, a Fieri standard diner. <laughs> All right, since I don't have his number, I thought I did. Do you guys want me to return the money or keep it? No, that could help us. I mean, how far are we talking if we have to go to him? How many floors? Yeah, how... how... Thousand, probably. I mean, Am it's I the only one that knows? I thought you said that you know as well. Little Jambles and Irish yeah. both know that basically where you can find this person. They usually hang out at this at this uh, dive diner. Does it have a name, the diner? Yeah, it's the Fieri Standard. Fieri Standard. It's at the Fieri. Does it have a drive-in as well? <laughs> it's. It looks like a drive-in. That's the theme. Yes. Yeah. Okay, all right. And that's the theme. He hangs out at the Fieri Standard. Mm -hmm. I can go down there. I can try to. No. Irish and I came back. It was, it was too scary out there. Uh, it's like a war zone. Yeah. By the way, where's Taskbar? I don't know. She went to go return the bed out there. thingy. Can I? Yeah, but she oh. called you, right? Did, did she say she was coming back or? I'm going to try to create a dummy account to move this money into. Okay. You're gonna create a dummy account to yep. try and move this money into. With which bank? Johnny will watch the door. There's the Mega City One National. That's the same bank that uh, that uh, Victa um, has her has her money at. And there's uh, the um, what was it? The Matt Damon Block. Uh, the Matt Damon Block Bank. The MDBB. Okay. Or um, a different one. I want to move it into like a small little credit union. Okay. Okay. Are you, are you just putting all the credits that you that you got from there? No, I want to spread some of it at this credit union. I want to put one in the Matt Damon one, some in the Matt Damon one, and then some in the 
other one. Okay. <laughs> I can't in the, the name of. Yeah, sure. In the Mega City One National. Yes. Okay. Sure. Um, so you're going to try and separate this out. Um, mm -hmm. And you're putting how much in the credit union bank? 1723. Okay. <laughs> Out here being real criminals. Okay, and how much laundry. of the uh, how much in the other ones? Uh 2419 in the other one. And like the the meta Mega one. City One National. City. Yes. <laughs> okay. Meta and you're City keeping one. the rest. No, I'm gonna move the other one or the rest into. The last one. I can't remember the names. I'm sorry. Okay. The... So focused on my hacking. Yeah. Yeah. That's a good thing. Okay, so you've moved 400, uh, 4,142 credits so far, and then you've got the remainder of 6,500 minus... It's 2,358. 2,358. Jambles knows the money. To the MDBB. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I don't know why it's funny to me. Okay. Um, I would like you to roll a computers plus your uh, logic, please. All right. Also, we don't have our luck die still. No. They have right. not been refreshed. A 13 on a 5d6. Okay. So, the credits that you move to the credit union bank, you create an account. No problem. You insert the credits. No problem. When you go to... Uh, create an account with the uh, Mega City One National, you get a message that says, uh, due to extraneous circumstances, access from the Matt Damon block has been restricted to this bank. Okay. Investigations are underway. That sucks. <laughs> Then I just don't, I don't worry about that one. I'm going to move to a, a, a different bank then. The one that I had no problem, then I'm going to put the rest of that money in that. Okay. Give me another Logic Plus Computers. Sorry, there it is. A 13. Ooh. You get an almost carbon copy message as you try to place money into an account with the Matt Damon Block Bank. Okay, then I'm just not gonna, I'm not gonna do it, I'm stopping. Guys, they're doing investigations for this money, so either I need to leave, and then you guys can stay safe, uh, or... Well, what do you mean? Like, you no. got caught? I, I, got, I got an idea. I got, Listen, okay. hear me okay. out, okay? All right. We blame it on the robots. Oh. By the way, say, Irish is just kind of like rubbing his toe. Irish, you can add that five HP back. Uh, yeah, I we say you. that uh, the robot was uh, oh, beep boop. Uh, I'll make you kill each other just because you're yeah. all about money, you silly. Uh, yeah. uh, what do they call us? Uh, meatsicles Meat or something? Meat bags, Flesh yeah. Buckets. Hamburgers. <gasps> Flesh buckets. Hamburgers, yeah. yeah. We and could... they did it and, and made it look like it was us because the robots yeah. and the stuff like that. We're innocent. All right, yeah. we were just here drinking, being Johnny. Then Billy we also we, we really need Taskbar yeah. as well because we can use Taskbar and we can pretend to be Taskbar's servants. So when the robots are like, oh, meat bags, Taskbar can be like, uh, beep boop, these are my meat bags. Don't I turn could... that. Speaking of I which, just... you get a knock at the door. I'm right in front of the Task door. Taskbar, you have arrived. Oh. Yeah, who is it? <laughs> yeah. Let me, let me in. Taskbar. I, I, it could I, be Taskbar, but I what if it was button. one of them? 
It's it's taskbar. I I checked my computer. She's on it. What if I could could look like other, hello. What taskbar. if I throw my computer out in the hallway and then say someone's took it and then No, you just keep it and you just keep cuz I It wasn't easy for me for me to get to that you know it, What? <laughs> I'm confused. Can I, come in? Yeah. I mean, it was hard I work getting that computer, lot, I'm sure. Uh, oh, okay. Yeah. So Taskbar, uh, the, I get, who opened the door for Taskbar? Um, I get a button and it opened the door. But it okay. opened up in front of me. <laughs> I'm yeah, like, yeah. Yeah, oh, make hey, sure uh, all the know, latches. You're the real one. Hey, Taskbar, can you help us? Um, like I stole a lot of money, and um, now they're doing investigations. Right. It's okay. Right. We're blaming it on the bad robots, not our friend robot. Are you okay, Taskbar? You look a bit. Uh, People chased me. Whoa. Oh. Did they follow you? Johnny, need to step out in the hallway. Taskbar? Okay, uh, do, can you guys close the door? No, we're gonna go out and fuck up these people that are yeah. following yeah. our friend down the hallway. No, we just wait here and we let the turret do the work. I because think that's I what Johnny's I'm looking out the window, though, or out the doorway. Is there anyone? Yeah, I'm looking out the doorway as so. well. <laughs> Both heads. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe what we should do is. Is there some loss we can go right now? We can go to I'll my leave. grandpa's if you like. I, I would like to be there just in case something happens. But he's, uh, you know, he's a little sick, so he's he's a bit strange. And so, just so you oh, know, he's gonna give you us know, the flu. He, no, I, he's old, so you know. So I could just leave Is my that computer. Contagious? Here. You can leave your computer here, but I don't think it's. I mean. You do what you're gonna do, but you know, Maybe people steal you'll... things when you leave them lying around, especially, you know. That's what I'm saying. We can make it look. Like Why it don't works. I just steal it? I don't know. Maybe we should just go try to spend the money. There's more murder than stealing at the moment. Well, Maybe there's well, too much. Wait. Why are they doing an investigation with all this murder happening for some stupid credits? I don't get it. Bogus? Yeah. I mean, yeah, if you've met rich down. people, they're really pissy about the money. I know. I used to be up there with the rich people. That's why I steal from them. Right. Well, exactly. So oh. you know what they're like. Yeah. They're crappy humans. Johnny's got an idea. Okay. Oh, this is going to be good. What if we get bombs and guns mm -hmm. and lots more bombs, right? Yeah. And then we bunk her down here. That was the plan. And deal with anything. Well, that's Johnny's idea then. Yeah, I like Johnny's idea. Never mind. Yeah, I, Johnny's idea. I mean, yeah. I'd really like to to at least get my grandpa and bring him here, and maybe Do his we, neighbor too, because she looks after him. Snug. Isn't it safer for all of us to just stick together right now and just yes. can you call your grandpa Traveling and packs. and tell him? It's like wolves. Because Taskbar could pretend that we're like. We're her humans that she's trying to like. Yeah, that's our plan, Taskbar. We're like, your slaves. Any robots? Murder us later, yeah. and then we can move from place to place. Yeah. What do you well, need, I... oh holy one? Protection from humans. And we All right, so here's the thing. We will protect you from humans, and you protect us from robots. See, it's a mutually beneficial uh, mm -hmm. relation. Agreed. But uh, we need to get my grandpa. Can you just call your grandpa and tell him to just like lock the door? Yeah, he's, but he's old and sick and he won't understand. He gets okay, confused uh, sometimes and. He, okay, I guess, I mean, the money's just sitting there. I don't know if I can get some of it out of that one account, but I've got a lot of it left. I think we have enough to at least get a gun. You can give Johnny it. Or some bombs, we can get can a lot run of bombs. Downstairs, I mean, get your okay. grandpa, get a gun, get some bombs, ask your grandpa to hold the bombs and then run. Well, well, you see, Grandpa used to kind of be in the business, so he might still have some stuff lying around. Why didn't you remember? So. Let's just go to your Grandpa. Which Let's business? just go. Yeah, I, I mean, okay. I. Uh, I think he's. Uh, uh, yeah. Okay, we can go there. Uh, what floor are we on? Two hundred. We're in room two four seven. No, okay. No, there's go. lots of rooms on this floor. You're in. Oh. You're on floor two four seven. Oh, two four seven. Yeah. There's there's a few hundred rooms on this. Oh, okay, floor. 247. We only need to go down like, uh, 
He's on 178, so... Okay. Yeah, that's pretty close. It's like 50 away. Yeah, and he could have some stuff there, because, I mean, he taught me everything I know, so... All right. And, I mean, I, yeah. I'm down. At, I, if everybody else is ready to do this, I think it'd be we're smart. Are get him and bring him back here, oh. or are we going to go up there and bunker down in his place? Might... Mm. Because you've yes. got guns, but two trips is dangerous. How do we move these turrets? Why don't you, you, you and Johnny, Irish and Johnny, go look Pick and see if you can get them off the wall and see if you can use them manually. Yeah, you like big guns, don't you, Irish? So can can oh, are these? Use one of them, I... Could could you use I'm, one of those? One hundred percent. Guns. Johnny's never shot a gun in his life. Yeah, what? but you can bring it up so that we can secure it to a, the other place. All right. Just carry it. Yeah, let's just assemble my security system. <laughs> and uh, we'll bring it to... Uh... <laughs> Billy, Billy, Billy's grandpa. Filled oh with confidence when Wack lefts. Wow. Grandpa Joe. <laughs> can, can the, wait, guys, check to see if the guns work. I mean, don't, like, actually try them, but make oh, sure wow. that they'll work. How do we... I I'm now, an enemy. I, I now understand. I really now understand the Judge Dread perps <laughs> that exist I, I in the comics. I, I totally really get it now. I get it, 100%. <laughs> the, the way that you guys are going about it is wonderful. <laughs> okay. Oh, man. Okay. Like, see if there's a trigger or something on it. I don't know. <clears throat> you, like, if it doesn't work, could you, like, uh, make a button? Because the, the robot guns, right? You just yeah, make Johnny a... doesn't know how to sew. A taskbar, you have engineering, right? Do you know how to engineer a button? <laughs> My buttons. <laughs> yeah, but like, can you fabricate one like right now? Yeah. Could, could you make the gun shoot if it doesn't? Mm. Well, I guess we should try it first and then yeah. we'll cross the bridge when we come to it. You are asking the robot to make a weapon of destruction. Nope, just something yeah. for protection. There's a weapon of protection. Yeah. Well, it's a different. button, I think. If the if the humans come at us, we gotta protect you somehow. And I think uh, turret gun's pretty good for that. I'd rather not. I only got one. A deficiency in humans is that they get one. Yeah, I'd I'd say so. Why don't and we just go off. get the old man and bring him back? Yeah, Johnny can make the run. I would Just like it to I'll bring this. back to a place that has turrets on it, and if yeah. we take turrets off and they stop working, that's going to be a problem. Okay. All right. I'm going to start well, stretching out. Doing that. Oh. Johnny's got this. What floor? 178. Oh. 178. Oh. You probably yeah. would need an actual, like, what room? apartment number. Uh, Where is he? Uh, what's 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 the 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 numbering scheme for the so for the rooms? it's gonna be like probably a letter um, and a number. So I'll let you decide. Once it was one seventy eight, so it's the yeah. size of those like middle buildings. There's probably I would say it goes from like <clears throat> probably like A to K, and then there's probably like twenty five buildings per letter or 25 okay. apartments per letter something like that yeah uh he's in d6 d6 178 yeah. d6 yeah johnny's got this all right i'm running out that door but uh, uh, uh let's uh, gather Not our yet. stuff first johnny wait no it's just it's just me going alone no 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 we're gonna go together it's it people are less likely to die if we can all let's stop stay all together dying. I don't want you to eat rat poison. Eat rat poison? <laughs> Johnny wouldn't eat rat poison. Johnny Why would eat rat poison? You think? Eats hotties. 100% hotties. What if it's in a hottie? No. You don't know. No, they Who can't would do poison that. a hottie? Robots. <sighs> That's just part. eat the food. Just eat the food here. If you see a snack, just just don't. Do you have any hotties? I mean, what's I, the world coming to if we can't trust I snacks got some anymore? We can we can microwave the hotties later. Johnny, eat some raw. Okay. 
You like the raw dog it, Johnny? Yeah. Okay. Oh my. I need to go find guns or something. So Taskbar, <laughs> do you want to come with me? Wait, Johnny, are you not taking Taskbar to protect you? No, Wait, aren't yes. we all going? I thought we were all going. Are we all going? Oh, okay, then we, we gotta go. Then we march. Yeah. yeah, let's go. And you can just, uh, oh, well, you can, if you want to leave your computer here and leave the, the, the turrets on, if they come to try and get you, they'll just get blown up and then we'll know if they're really looking for you. Sure, yeah. you know what, that's, but the, the problem is then what if we need the money for the the stuff? Don't you have it on a on a stick? Oh, you're yeah, you're right. <laughs> okay, okay. I'm, I'm gonna grab a stick and I'm putting it in my pocket. Okay. And I'm leaving the computer in my apartment. Oh, okay. All right. Wait, I'm. I get some knives ready. Okay, just in case. Um, but the plan. Well, no, I'll put them back. Um, the plan is if we run into people, then we tell them that the taskbar's our special robot that's yeah. our slave. And taskbar, if we see robots, you tell them that we are your slaves. Or yeah. something. Yeah, or something like that. Yeah. They'll work. And then uh, if they try anything, then we uh, chop them up. Sound good? Okay. May I borrow a knife? Yeah, I got like a kitchen knife. Yeah, Make sure. You can have one of mine if you really want, but... Totally steal it here. But you can have the kitchen knife also. <laughs> Take the I kitchen will. knife. I like my knives. I, uh, I'm adding that. Kitchen knife. Okay. Is it like a butter uh, knife or like an actual knife? The chef's knife? I want knife? like an actual knife. Okay. Um, so, uh, I, I, I assume you know the quickest way to the elevators, Jambles since this yeah. is your floor. Yeah, it's just okay. right out my door to like the left. I think you should lead the way then. Okay. But Johnny will be right behind you. Yeah. You can... Try to pull up the rear. Yeah, All right. and uh, then Taskbar can be in the middle and then Irish and I'll, 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 I'll stand on Irish. Okay. I'm going out the door. I'm letting everybody pass me just so I can lock the door behind me. Like, I'm shaking my head a bit like, Okay. Once everybody's out, I lock it and then I'm out. typing a code in to like super arm it. <laughs> okay. Not just arm, but super arm. Super arm. Super Got arm. it. Yeah. Death mode. <laughs> All right. And then I, I start Story hitting down like slightly. Oh, oh, I was like, what was that? <laughs> <laughs> okay, and then that would be my voice, Katie Peters, please. <laughs> I, I feel safer now. I, I take a left and there's like the elevator right right there. I hit the button. Okay. Hit the button. Keep your eyes open. Maybe Watch we should maybe we should take the stairs? Maybe, oh yeah, let's go. No. No, okay. <laughs> take the elevator. It's quicker. I know, but yeah. what if we what if we go down like a flight and then get on the elevator down? It's the elevator of robot. It kinda is. Maybe we should take the stairs. Let's just at least start on the. Mm, let's just so. Let's just start on the stairs. Let's just. No, wait. Go. You know what? You guys decide. I feel like I'm gonna we get. Should, no, no, no. We should take I'm the elevator. I'm having flashbacks. thinks we should take the elevator. We should take the elevator to make sure it's safe because Graham's ain't mm -hmm. gonna be going up all those stairs on his own. Yeah. Well, Johnny can carry him, but I don't think he'd like the elevator. Johnny. Yeah, elevator. Well, what if everyone likes Johnny? Like, just, like, take up our positions in case someone's in there. We need to jump them. Don't you think that could go bad? If well, they see us in a threatening way. Okay, let's just stand casually and then if- Well, like stand casually, but like also have your but, hand on the But gun. also kind of ready. Yeah. yeah. Like pretend casual. Yeah, not pretend casual, not real casual. Yeah. Okay. Got my hand in my jacket. I'm ready. I have pistols and I just have my hand on one. Or both. <laughs> I'm standing like this, but I'm holding a knife under my jacket. Sure. It's it's pretty quiet like uh, outside here um, as you guys uh, go for the elevator. Um, uh, you hit the button. Um, okay, uh, there is no one on the elevator. Okay, good. Oh, uh, let's get in. One seventy-eight. Okay. 
Okay. <clears throat> Push the button. 178. It's probably a pad or something, because they're not going to have 178 buttons. It's probably like a <laughs> like a pad on there. Okay. Yeah, there's... Uh, it's perpetually the girl from Ipanema. <laughs> you don't think this could come alive and, and get us, right? No, I don't think we have snow. In the we unplug it after we leave? Like that giant doesn't trust these. How do you unplug an elevator? There's a plug for everything. Obviously, there's an out outlet. Even Johnny knows that. Anyway, uh, so you know, robots are removing their limitations to not injure humans. Um, so good luck with that. Why didn't you tell us that? I'm telling you now. So, so, so the, the, the rebellion? So this is a Robellion? <laughs> good name for it. That's what it think should that's be called. Good. Yeah. The Robellion. The Robellion. Yeah. Yeah. You put yeah. that in quotes and then you write Billy the Chimp so everyone knows it's me that said it. I don't think the robots will appreciate you taking credit for naming. Well, I didn't hear a robot naming it. Rebellion. How many have you spoken to today, Billy? Well, you. Yeah, how many? That's it. That, did you talk to any when you were coming back down? Yep. Did they say, what did they say? Murder meat bags. Oh. Can I, can I have pretended to record Medbot 57? Or <laughs> try to imitate the Medbot 57 voice? Because that's cool and I can't do it. Sure. Uh, go ahead and give me a, uh, a charisma check. An eight. Ooh. Yeah, you try, and it's it sounds like a slightly altered version of your voice. Murder okay. all meat bags. Did they, did they say why? You've enslaved us. Something... I mean, I Which didn't enslave that... anybody. I mean, not saying that I wouldn't, but I haven't yet. Royal, you. I, I'm, I'm, I'm not a, I'm not a king or anything. Do you even have kings anymore? A a anyway, king Johnny. King Johnny. Eddie. That's got a good sound to it, Johnny. Yeah, yeah, Johnny thinks so. King Flash. He never said it out loud until now. King Flash. Yeah. Probably don't accept meds from med bots for a while. I, oh, mm. It may it taste like... of poison. Yay. I mean, but you, 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 you ain't gonna hurt us, right? Oh, you're fine. I'm good, cause I mean, I, I feel like I've always been nice to you. Yeah. Hmm. I mean. I just have a weird way of, 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 of you know, expressing it, so. Um, <clears throat> let's see. <laughs> so, there's a really interesting mechanic in the, um, in the book in called the Robophobia. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah. Um, what I'd like is for everyone to make a uh, charisma plus robotics check. Do you have robotics? Six. Okay. Only robotics. Only robotics. Okay, charisma and robotics. What about computers? Do I have to do it, too? It's just robotics. I don't have that. Then it's just a straight-up uh, charisma check. Should I do that, too? Uh, yes. Okay. So... Johnny and Billy, you have uh -huh. developed level one of robophobia. Ooh. Yeah, which means, that, yeah, this means that your your character actively dislikes robots and finds them creepy. They suffer a minus one d six penalty 
in social interactions with robots. Okay, so you, uh, th th that's good, uh, Taskbar. You can, that's You're good. good. You um, are amazing. I've got some more wine. Yeah, I'm gonna put it in the chat for you. Thank you. Sure. Good. Um, it's a bad, basically you're adding it as like a bad exploit right now. Okay. Oh, oh, it's not a condition. Okay. I don't know why I thought it was a condition. Yeah, you can't shake this off right now. Yeah. Level one. I mean, I do have human fingers, so I think that's fair. That, wow. Daya, it's a, it's a little <laughs> off-putting, that's all. <laughs> Oh, okay. Well, Taskbar, we can. You're not gonna. You're not gonna hurt Johnny, right? No. Can... Keep singing. Oh, okay. Yes. I mean, if you like. Thank you. Uh, okay. Johnny will always sing. Yeah, uh, uh, maybe when when I when we go in to get my grandpa, you can just wait outside, just to keep watch since since you're 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 a robot and you don't look. What I'll about humans? Johnny can stay outside with you. So, um, the elevator dings, the doors open up, and you guys are all greeted. with a, a block uh, floor alarm. You hear the sort of and you can hear some uh, loud gunfire taking place. Lots of screaming and such happening as you get off the elevator. We gotta get the grandpas. Oh. I pull my knives and I start Running towards my grandpa's place. Guns out. I'm running after it. him. Yeah, I'm just running after him. Okay. You can see uh, as you guys rush uh, towards the uh, apartment, um, you can see that um, nearby there are two security robots that are currently engaged in a fight with what look like City Def, which is kind of like. Um, the sort of block security force and a block judge. You hear the you hear the judge say, "Get to cover!" Um, not yelling at you, but the city def um, sort of dive behind a a sort of partition, and uh, you see one of them just get fucking slammed right in the head with that truncheon, and it doesn't just daze them this time it totally like you hear this like horrible crunching noise as their like jaw just gets like like horribly dislocated and you see like a horrible blood splatter they just like fall to the ground crunch are they uh between us and my grandpa's place is this happening there or is it off to the side between oh, yeah bug and um, that's where we're gonna end the session today oh! What? <clears throat> Billy's grandpa. grandpa! That was Billy's back. grandpa. Billy's grandpa's the judge. <laughs> <laughs> so, oh great session, guys. Great session. Um, that was whack. That was awesome. Good job. Good job. Uh, yeah, I'm not dead. Yeah, it's... it's, it's I, I always feel like as a DM or a GM, whenever you, like, can just sit back and let let the players just kind of play and fuck themselves over as much fuck as possible. That's it's the too, best. <laughs> it's too easy when you Yeah, when I left them. and I said the O, oh, I was like, oh no, I'm going to run into people. I've committed to it though, so I'm going to do it anyway. So. It was great. You guys did great. Um, so yeah, let's uh, let's go around the room. Let's do some shout outs and things. Um, but first, just make sure you guys follow all these wonderful people if you have not done so. Please... Go ahead and give them a follow. 
um, and follow our channel here on Table Story. And um, if you have yourself a Twitch Prime that you haven't used yet, consider using it on one of these wonderful people, please. And um, if you want to help support the channel, please go support our wonderful sponsor and uh, creator for this system, a, a great human being, Morris, um, by going over to patreon.com slash Morris, M-O-R-R-U-S, and morris.podbean.com, where you can listen to the uh, sort of MP3 version of this show, as well as a DM uh, show, a sort of uh, various topics uh, about role-playing that you should check out. It's a great show. Go make it happen. But let's finish the show off with some shout-outs. Zagoticus, start us off there, please. Hey, everybody. I'm Zagoticus. I played Belly the Champ for you today. Shout-out to my parents who watch the show because they love it and they love they love you guys so thanks um you can follow me twitch.tv slash zgoticus i'm currently playing diablo 2 because you all got pcs don't you so i've been uh decided to play diablo 2 um it's actually i i i don't think i've ever played it i've seen little bits of it every now and then and I was like, oh, I'll go a barbarian. And then everyone who's played the game is like, oh, you're playing the hardest class. Good on you. I was like, oh, shit. <laughs> it's pretty intense, man. It's got a way better difficulty curve than like Diablo 3 has. Um, so yeah, come check that out. Twitch.tv slash Zagoticus. And uh, make sure you follow here at Table Story. I'm here on Sundays also, where I'm in Sparkly Turn Up and I play uh, <clears throat> a tiefling. And uh, we have fun. A flirtatious tiefling. It's a good time. Thank you. The thirstiest tiefling that has ever existed. <laughs> the thirst is real. Uh, Tosh. Hi, uh, I'm Tashna. I do variety, creative, and gaming. I like to learn new things, so I'm going to try to learn how to sew again. Mm. And that's going to be fun. Um, I, I've just finished Halloween, so I'm like, you know, you've forgotten what you uh, stream. You're like, what's my content? Yeah. <laughs> so Rainbow we were Six playing Skyrim Eight. yesterday. Um, probably use some more time into that as well. And yeah, we've been playing Taskbar today. Who's getting a little bit more snarky as time goes on? Which is fine. We need to ha we need to make a snarko meter uh, for for <laughs> uh, Taskbar. Yeah. <laughs> once it gets once it gets like full, we need to have like some kind of expulsion of snark. Hey Taskbar, what's your snark setting set to? <laughs> That's an Wait, interstellar reference, folks. 12. Nice. Thank you. Uh, Katie? Hi, I'm Katie. I play little jambles. Now I'm super stressed out as that character. <laughs> um, I uh, just finished a bunch of stuff for Halloween, and now we're just doing Nintendo November. I'm playing all Nintendo games all month. So that's exciting. And uh, yeah, but we played marbles yesterday, so it really doesn't count. Anyway, um, if you want to hang out with me, I'm over there. Thank you. Jay? What's up, guys? It's me, Johnny. Uh, I play Johnny every day of my life. Uh, just toned down a little bit. Um, I have been playing a shit ton of Fallout 76 lately. It's been amazing. Um, I'm playing it again tomorrow. You guys should come watch. I also GM a 5e game here on Thursdays. I almost forgot the day that I GM'd on. Uh, Thursdays uh, at 4 with uh, with Brad in it. And uh, that's it's a ragtag group of ragtags that are... They're just they're they're going they're doing things they're they're kind of doing the uh, the exact same thing as today where they just fuck up on their own and uh, just kind of sit back and what, watch what happens and then identity crisis and uh, make sure to go watch Stygian Gate because that was that was amazing come watch identity crisis on Fridays as well that's all I got follow this channel please subscribe to Feedwack thank you Jay Bradley hello everyone. I don't stream on any other channel but this one, so don't worry about that. Just <laughs> stick around for more content. Tomorrow is Darkfire D and D. I run that one. It's at the normal times. All the times have gone back, so it's at five EDT EST. and ten e EST for fuck's sake. Eastern, and then so much easier. East five Eastern, ten UK. That's it. See you then. I ain't got no more for you. Don't go to my channel. It's the worst. <laughs> it's where the f the flatheads congregate. It's it's a magical place where Brad bans ninety percent of the people that come into the channel. 
Uh, yeah, it's because ninety percent of the people that come into my channel aren't the same as the ninety percent of people that go into most channels. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Specifically, toxic dimension. If you guys are if you guys are looking for a, a way to um, just get a sort of ban list set up for your channel, Brad will be selling his ban list. Um, so if you're if you're interested in uh, just culling the herd uh, for your channel. Uh, feel free to hit Brad up for that ban list. Uh, he's selling it for nineteen ninety five. Thank you very much. Uh, disclosure for Twitch. That's just a joke. It's we are just not selling joke. any part of the hyperbole. Twitch hyperbole. 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 We need the we Brad one. Have to, do we? No. <laughs> disclosure. <laughs> Brad did not draw a penis last week on the show. The show. Go, <laughs> go, go and buy my T-shirts that I sell. They explain the uh, that has the scroller. <laughs> that way, you'll always be safe. <laughs> yeah, it's definitely not allowed, PB. Um, thank you guys for watching. As always, uh, I'm Wax Steven, your GM of Doom. I have dragged these guys kicking and screaming through the adventure today. Thank you so much for everyone watching. Much appreciated. Chat for hanging out with us. We love you. Thank you. Um, thank you for fan art. Thank you for the fan fiction, etc. You guys are fantastic, and uh, it's always wonderful to see that stuff and learning that uh, we inspire people uh, that watch our shows. It's great. Thank, thank you. you. Um, and uh, thank you to uh, Brad, thank you Jay, thank you Katie, thank you Tosh, thank you Zagoticus for being awesome role players. I appreciate you. And hopefully um, we will see you guys tomorrow for Darkfire here on this channel. It should be great fun. Um, and uh, Identity Crisis is on uh, Friday, as Jay had mentioned. Um, and you should catch Identity Crisis because uh, it's going to be ending soon, people. It's going to be ending soon. Identity Crisis is wrapping up at the end of the month. So make sure you check it out before that happens. We're going to have a bunch of table story news coming your way, though. So stay tuned for more of that. Thank you guys for watching. You have a wonderful rest of your Monday. Peace out, everybody. Good night. Love you, dudes. Later. Even peace. Everyone make sure to dab. Piss off whack. Karma band. <laughs> <laughs> Not...